How was the gym? I didn't go. Shit, I didn't go. I sat my white ass home. And I went, ooh. And I, and I didn't do shit. So I did a sponsored deliverable. This video is brought to you by Experience Smart Checking Accounts. Something like that. You need a haircut? I do need a haircut. I do need a haircut. You are right about that. I, I, you know what? Actually, I don't need a haircut. I need a hair fucking growth. I, I, I went on a run today. Chill. I went on a run. What's there to cut? The sides, man. Look at that. Look at that. My sideburns. They're loose. Now, I don't want to go blonde again. I'm sick of that. I'm sick of it. Same shirt. Can you guys not be hard on me? I actually just have to cancel an event of mine. I'm sort of like, I'm really emotional. <laughs> yeah, I did eat the rabbit. It was fire. When is the squeak stream? Tomorrow at noon. Tomorrow at noon o'clock. Squeaks and me. 24 hours. Oh my god. That's what I forgot. Can you... Uh, no, I gotta find it. Chat, what's one of them... What's chat? What's one of them, like, 30 days grow a beard kit things? Is there, like, a name of one? I want to try it for one month. Fishing stream's getting worked on by Shake Drizzle, but the thing about Shake Drizzle is he's getting worked on by everybody at Mogul Moves Company at Melee. So it's hard for him to find time in between. Rogaine? Cocaine. It's not called cocaine. Coots is here. Somewhere. She'll be here tomorrow, too. For the 24 hour. Coots! So here's my thing. Here's my thing. I Okay, so I can't grow a beard. This is, like, all I got. And, and like, this is about six years of work. I want to try one of those one-month beard-growing kits and see how much better my beard gets. That's my goal. I want to and make a video about it, you know? I want to do, like, a Drew Gooden video minus the humor. Shlonky Bowser is a beard growing kit. What? <laughs> what am I Googling? What am I Googling? Is this like a... What is Shlonky Bowser? This is what came up. Hey guys, John here with a quick... What is Shlonky Bowser? What is this? Why am I Googling Schlonky Bowser? Who's Dick Bowers? Who's this dude? Dick Bowers was an American college athletics as administrator. This motherfucker could have run chess boxing. Though originally hired to be a physical education professor, USF hired John Allen. What am I reading? He has two children, Rick Jr. and Delia, Delis Delisa. He was the father-in-law of pro wrestler Mike Awesome. Huh. The more you know. No, it's not pre-recorded. Look. I don't I don't know what to do to make you not think that. I would never do that. I would never do that in a film video. Um been binging Japan Eat Shorts because you mentioned them again recently. Got the one where he says hi, Ludwig. Dude, when I got that one, I freaked out. I don't know if I've shown it on stream. But when I hit that one, it was like, whoo! I don't know. I don't even know which one it is, to be honest. Hello and well. Okay, that's for later. That's jet lag for later. Uh, all right, chat. Welcome back to the stream. Second stream of the day. First time I've ever been honest about doing a second stream. Who would have thought? Let me first off tag the entirety of my Discord. Let them know I'm live on YouTube.com slash at Ludwig slash live. 
Chat, can I ask you guys an honest question before we jump into our agenda points today? Coots! 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 Sorry, I'm getting excited. Oh, should I try out the wheel with Coots? Maybe we'll save it for tomorrow with Squeaks. Hi, Coots! Hi, Coots! Hi! Hi, you! Hello! Hello! Coots was Coots, so I brought Coots in here first time she's ever been in here and then I stepped on a toy duck and then I couldn't find her for a half hour <laughs> I think she hid under the couch so the ducks are not Coots friendly which is a problem because I have 900 of them so live and Coots is here Coots why would you do that what do you mean? It's a. F Why would you do that? Why would you buy 900 rubber ducks? Yes, you can ask us. And yes, the answer is you are awesome and the best YouTuber. What, do you thought the question was going to be, hey guys, do you think I'm the best YouTuber? You thought that was my question? How'd you know? Chat, here's my question for you. It has been 21 months since I went to YouTube.com. YouTube.com slash at Ludwig slash live. Do you think the experience on YouTube is better, equal to, or worse than when it was on Twitch? Go. Yes is not really an answer. You're milking this? What do you mean milking this? It's my fucking job. Hey, here's the thing. It's my job in the two years of my contract come up this year. And so if you guys all said it's worse, then that would weigh into my considerations of what I should do. <laughs> this is biased because we're on YouTube. Yeah, you're right. I don't disagree. Ads make Twitch unwatchable? Well, ads exist here on YouTube. I guess I just don't have to run it as much. Thank you for the 20 months mini destructo. Thank you, Kenichi Kage, for the, uh, the membership. Appreciate it. I think, so here's what I think. Here's what I think. I genuinely thought that YouTube would do a little more in the time that I've been on the platform to make it a better live streaming platform. Does that make sense? Now, it's it's funny, right? Cuz like YouTube almost looks better than like it did 2 years ago, but I don't think it's because of the things YouTube did. I feel like it's because of the things Twitch did. So, like, if it's a contest of who is taller, rather than YouTube giving themselves some apple boxes to stand on, Twitch is just digging a bit of a hole. And I think, like, if we're being real with ourselves, Twitch is still ahead of YouTube in the live streaming space, right? Like, I think that's... I don't think I'm breaking ground saying that. I think we all understand that to be a fact. Yeah, there's not... Like, it's not one for one. The rewind feature's way better here. The pause feature's way better here. But, like, there's, you know, we made a list the other day. 12-hour VODs. Um, the fact that you watch ads even if you're a member. The chat, the way it flows. Like, a lot of the changes were made in part because of um, Truffle. Thank you for the membership, Retro Rifler, Masked Mab, Dep, Yandy. Everett waits. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. 16 months, 21 months. Whee. Twitch ads are brutal. Yeah, Twitch is better overall, but Twitch, they have a few, like, bad things about them. You think I'd get more viewers if I was on Twitch today? Or less viewers? Or the same? I feel like it'd be the same. Thank you. 
It might, I mean, shit, it might be less now. I think it, I think it'd be a higher, a higher floor. What I occasionally notice, <laughs> what I occasionally notice with YouTube is it's brutal the drop off you get sometimes if you go to the bathroom or switch discussion points or play a game that people aren't as interested in. It's like, pfft, it's crazy. Which, and I, I didn't feel like that used to happen on Twitch. I am the YouTube guy. That is true. It do be me, the YouTube guy. What graphics card do you use? I think it's a 3090. Oh, no. Yeah, it's definitely a 3090. That bitch is huge. Um, all right, chat. Well, that's all I wanted to chat about for that. Was curious your thoughts. Back to today's stream. We have a few things we have to get through today. First off, Tim keeps linking me this clip. I don't know what it is. This place is... I'm scared. He hits me. <laughs> what? No, I don't... What? No, I don't hit him. Why do you say that? This place is... I'm scared. He hits me. I don't do that. Who is he talking... I don't do that. What a stupid... Fucking... I don't do that. But you haven't even addressed the exclamation point allegations yet. You okay. can't keep getting away with it. How's it going? Uh, today we're going to be talking about my tax problems. I uh, unfortunately hired an influencer tax person who was taking a mental health break the day before taxes were due. Now, usually that's a fine thing to say, but unfortunately, my taxes were due tomorrow anyway. So I had to go to H&R Block or an unnamed company and ask someone to file my taxes on an emergency basis. But here's where it got a little bit trickier because what happened was uh, the tax person was an old Indian woman and I had to explain to her what a streamer was. Now call me old fashioned. Mike. <laughs> what is this? It's Mumbai Mail. <laughs> Here to talk about the numerous tax issues that have come up. <laughs> I don't talk like that. He's doing like Slime's impression of me. I guess Slimes is worse. Slimes like, well, here's the thing. <laughs> Once it hits the back of the throat, that's maybe where you think the end is. But for most, that's actually just the start. And you really want to unlock your jaw and just suck it down. <laughs> and that's like Slimes' version of me. I'm like, dude, what? You make me sound like a f cartoon character. It's not biblically accurate. First of all, what does the term biblically accurate even mean? I would not consider the Bible biblically accurate. They got some shit in there. There's a few different versions. Which Bi There's so many different Bibles. King James? Biblically accurate? I wouldn't think so. I also keep getting recommended this clip. I got to recommend it in a short... Like, it feels like a fever. Apparently, Valkyrie had a nightmare about me. Fever a dream. Oh my god! I forgot to tell you guys about my nightmare last night. I had a nightmare. And it was the worst nightmare. And it was Ludwig. Ludwig. <laughs> okay. Hurtful, right? Oh, let's think about how our words could hurt people. Uh, we didn't. We just said things. Okay, great. It was... It, it was just, like, such a nightmare because I feel like it could have happened. Like, it felt real. Okay, all right. It could have happened, and it involves me. Let's let me let's digest what she says and see if we think that I would have done what she's about to say. Let me tell you guys. Okay, my nightmare. So I had just won a dirt bike race, and I won a free Xbox. What part of this is believable? <laughs> we have already ventured into unbelievable territory. Both her winning a dirt bike race and then the, the prize being an Xbox is also unbelievable. 
I was really excited. I remember in my dream feeling like this is the first time I have a, an item after the fire. There was a fire where a long time ago. <laughs> what? 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 This is the first time I've had an item after a fire. Okay, so she had a fire. So this is like a fucking Disney Channel movie. She had a fire, burned all her house down. She's obsessed with riding dirt bikes. She's a dirt bike rider. She wins. She finally gets an Xbox and she's able to start a collection of items again. Like fucking Ariel. Ludwig lit my room on fire by lighting a candle and so i come back to my place i'm living in this like weird apartment building where there's a bunch of other streamers and stuff and i have people over like Myung, leslie hassan was there and ludwig was there too and it was like a streamer apartment weird place and in my setup i wouldn't live with them I just, I candidly, I wouldn't live. Already, I would not live with them. Are you kidding me? <laughs> There's no universe. There's no universe. In a streamer room, I could never. There is a drawer, and Ludwig is using my setup to stream. He, as he's streaming from my setup, he takes a candle, lights the candle, and puts it in the drawer. And I asked him, I was like, Ludwig, you already lit my room on fire. Please don't do this again. What? 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 How many layers deep? I've already done it? That's insane. How'd I already do it? Okay. All right. The two time. The two time of YouTube. People call me that. It is a real name. I get a lot. Like, I'm begging you. I just got this free Xbox and I'm really excited for it. I lost everything and I don't want to lose this wait, again. Wait, 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 wait. Rewind, now I'm catching up. She had a bunch of stuff. I lit her fucking room on fire. It all burned down. She finally does a dirt bike race, to, race wins it to get her first item back in Xbox, and then invites me? Not only that, I live with her still? If I burned her house down, we would not be roommates anymore. Like, that's enough to not be roommates anymore. Am I crazy? I burned your fucking house down. And then I'm holding a candle, and your all your all your only reaction is, "Oh, not again!" Enough with the candles. I'm not victim blaming. No, I am victim blaming because she's not a victim. And he's like, "Right, it's fine. Don't worry. Don't worry. It's fine." And then, instantly, my room is in flames, and I'm freaking out in my dream. I'm freaking out, and I'm I'm tell I'm yelling at everyone. I'm yelling at me, and I was like, "Please grab some stuff." And take it out. Take everything you can and take it out of my room, please. I bet I help. My room's on fire and I'm freaking out. I bet I help. Take some. And out. the only thing I grabbed from my room was a real. I have a pile of not important documents, but they're documents that I feel like I could throw away, but I'm not quite sure if I could throw them away. Actually, in my room, that life advice: you can throw away any document at any point. Never think about it twice. Trust the words out of my mouth. Burn them. All of the documents manifested in my dream, and that's the only pile I took out of my burning room. Was this pile of paper that actually exists, but I don't know if I should throw it away or not? Kind of papers, you know, those kind of papers that it's like they're they're like kind of important, but not really at all. Like they just sit there, and so. I took that pile of paper out of my room and I remember being so disappointed that that was the only thing I grabbed out of my room. I go back into my room that's on fire. Ludwig is so nervous and he's so stressed out that he caused another fire in my room <laughs> that he proceeds to vomit all over my legs and my feet. <laughs> what, dude? Why is Dream Ludwig such a fucking baby back and excuse my gendered language? Biatch. What is this? I just set her house on fire twice and throw up on her? Like what it I have zero and and count it zero like good good skills. I'm just the worst human. And in my dream, we're in my room and it's smoky, it's burning. I pissed. Oh, I, Maybe I'm, I'm trying to put the fire out. And that's what she didn't consider. Is I'm trying to act as the fire hose. I just misfired on some hose. <laughs> Sorry, inappropriate. inappropriate. So sad. Inappropriate. I'm sobbing no, no, no. in my Obviously. dream because Obviously. not only did this bitch light my room. Okay, now she called me the B word. Oh, uh, claws are out. 
claws are out. <laughs> okay. I was having fun with this. Now the claws are out. On fire again. He threw up all over my legs and on my feet. And I remember seeing it in my dream and just looking at him in disgust. Like, how could you do this to me? And uh, then I woke up. That was the nightmare I had last night. It's not a nightmare. It was horrible. No, if anything, it's like it a- It was so horrible. No, it's like a good- It was all Ludwig's fault. Bonding experience. It's not my fault, because I didn't do anyway, it. I, I wasn't there. I can't believe I forgot to tell you guys my dream. That was so crazy. It, you could have not told him, because I- Yeah, I. it was just kind of cool, like, winning a free Xbox. Like, I won the dirt bike. Why didn't rig. you- I thought the story was going to end with, like, her bringing the Xbox. Ludwig will have so much fun reaction to this. It's not fun! BQV9I318? Nothing fun about being accused of being an arsonist, although I will say, oh my god. So, when I was in middle school, we were charged with the task of doing a radio play for one of my classes. Which is basically like the worst form of media before they had good forms of media like TV and movies. Uh, and our, our radio play was being done at my friend Reed's house. So, we pulled to my friend's Reed house, Reed's house, we're, we're working on the radio play. I see homie's got matches on the counter and instantly I see the matches and without even talking to him, I just walk up and I go and I just stare at it until it like goes down to its nub and then I like throw it over my head and then I and then I walk away and uh, and then we go upstairs and like 30 minutes pass and we're working on the radio play and by that I mean we're playing uh, floor hockey and then his mom comes home and she she I've never heard a a louder yell she shouts she goes Ree! Ree! and he sprints downstairs eyes wide open and i'm like oh my god this motherfucker did something bad and then his mom just starts chewing him out and i'm hearing it and then and but i but like i hear little words like through the through the wall you know it's kind of like one of those like uh it's like one of these videos listening to you know Blink-182 while your parents are fighting in the other room. You guys can all judge me if you want. Uh, anyway, uh, I, I hear I hear them yelling, and she's like, she's like, she's like, who lit a fucking match? Who lit a fucking match in this house? And then Reed's like, it was Ludwig. And she's like, bring him down here right now. And then I get chewed out for lighting a match. And she was just pissed. She was like, that was so dumb of you. You could have burned the house down. And I was like, bro... I like the smell of matches. You're being weird. It's a good smell. So, I, you know, it's somewhat realistic I would burn down Ray's house. It's unrealistic that I would burn it down twice, though. Uh, all right, chat, we've been doing this for, uh, I mean, past couple of weeks. I'm going to try to keep doing it. A mini Reddit recap where we take a look at some of the posts over the past week, talk about them, chit chat. And our first one we got to talk about is this post. One of the top posts of the week. Is there lore why Ludwig wears a Wisconsin sweatshirt? And then um, that's it. That's the whole. It's I wore this during Jerma's, I think, house flipper thing. Might even be older than that. Might even be a... This is like a Sims thing? I don't even know. Um, no. It's just a sweater I own. That's it. I don't even think it's... I think it's cuties, to be honest. $50! Hey, Lud. What's new with you, man? Hey, Brycey. I just canceled the biggest event of my career uh, and lost $100,000 in sunk costs. Outside of that, I got a new deadlift PR yesterday. Oh, yay. I, I deadlift 355. I'm now 25 pounds off the 1,000-pound club. Thank you the $20 100%, though. Thank you. Is, I, 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 um, I think I'm going to start sumo squatting. Although I worry that if I sumo squat, that people won't count it. You know what I mean? I feel like people get weird about sumos. But to me, they count. They're real. 
And my quads are big, so I feel like I should do sumo. I just don't... Oh, I'm logged into Squeaks as TTS. No wonder. I was getting so few follows. Uh, thank you. The, uh, $30. That's a W, but aren't you worried about hurting your back? No. I'm not. I have pretty good deadlift form. So, I don't know. Coos! <laughs> she goes, hey. holy shit. Hold up. I got $100? Here, homie, since you lost 100K, oh, please don't give me money for that reason. It's okay that I lost 100K. I make a lot of money. Uh, it's 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 okay to lose it, you know? I'll get it back one day. <laughs> Surely. Did the TTS work? Did you guys hear that? Oh, wait. He probably turned it off. There it is. I think it'll work now. Try it again. Mods. Beep, 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 beep. Um, thank you, Space Cat Man. Thank you, uh, Sue Macon, for the membership. Thank you, Clerk, Clerk, Click, Clickle, Clickle, Clerk, Clerk, Clerk. Hey, have you guys not heard it yet? Wait, dead ass? Are you not hearing this thing going test, test? No? Oh, wait, Squeaks muted it. Hold up, sorry. Last time, last time. This is Squeaks' fault. He took over my setup and fucked it all up. Thank you, Christopher Anderson, for the Test. eight months. There we go. You guys heard that one for sure. There it is. You guys heard that one. Don't lie. It's time for the Reddit. So is that all you wanted to do was play this? Blake, thank you. Lud, I want to ask you, you don't have to comment if you don't want, but could you see yourself streaming with Atrioc again? I would love your collabs. I love your collabs so much, but it's understandable however you feel. Uh, I haven't thought about uh, much about just collabing. I just, I we hang out. I hang out with my friend, Atrioc. Uh, I think we're going to go hiking. Sumo actually targets different muscles. It makes the deadlift slightly easier, though, but it's personal preference. I know, but there's a huge, like, you're a little baby bitch mentality if you do sumos. But I have big, huge quads, and they're better for sumos. So I would like to, I would like to do that because I have big, huge quads, and I'd like to do it. Do, 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 do. Hey, but, thank you for inspiring my gambling addiction. You're welcome. I am now oh. doing girl math daily to be able to pay my medical bills, and it is awesome. That's great. That's so great. I love that for you. I love that for you. Uh, all right, chat. Let's focus. Yeah, the reason I don't think about content is because, I don't know, people are weird, right? People are weird no matter what, and avoiding weird people is ideal to like not make friendship weird but like there's people on literally all sides of the debate who feel entitled to an opinion on my relationship with atrioc and so like the more in public eye it is i think the more weird people crop up that's all uh, random question, but before off brand, did you manage streaming as a sole enter, a sole proper, sole prop, 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 so, oh, fuck, dude, what the hell are you asking me? Before off brand, did you manage streaming as a sole proper, 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 is this proprietorship? Is that what this word is? Proprietorship? You spelled that wrong, right? Surely proper tiership business or LLC. Was it just having fun? I don't give a fuck. Hey, Dayton, thanks for writing in. I didn't pay taxes until somebody else uh, feel dealt it all for me. Thanks for asking. I hope that helps. Uh, lack of reality. Just want to take take my money so I don't spend it on OnlyFans. Pour one out for the Goon Commander. Okay, thank you for the nine ninety nine of your jerk-off dollars. How is Coots doing? She was right here. She's doing well. 
Sorry if that question is too intrusive. I don't think it's that intrusive. I think it's I think it's a lot of people are curious. Lost my job a week ago. Big L for me, but your content has really cheered me up. Can't wait for the RV stream with Sea Dog. Yeah, oh my god, we should wait. Look at that. Well, I guess let's get through this subreddit. Let's get through this subreddit. So the the first post we gotta look at. Uh yes, this is just a sweater. This is just a sweater. That's it. There's no lore. I just own a sweater. So I don't know why this is the top post. Uh, that's it. Go Wisconsin. Uh, back to it. Next post. Did anyone else find Ludwig's defense of XQC in his recent stream sad? He completely dismisses XQC's homophobia and misogyny by going, yeah, but look how bad Ice Poseidon is, and bringing up something on Twitter as if that makes X's behavior okay. Um, I, a, lot, I think some, a lot of people felt this way. Second, third highest post. I think people are more passionate about the sweater, but close second to that. Uh, I, I I replied actually in a comment that got drowned. <laughs> I got freaking uh, quintuple ratioed on my own subreddit. Uh, but I said, I think people are quick to bandwagon X because he does a lot of asshole stuff. And I get a pass because I don't do a lot of asshole stuff. Which was basically the feeling. I, I think that I felt more culpable than I was getting credit for throughout the course of the video. And if the argument, which it was, was being stemmed that like, hey, reacting to media like this is bad, especially if you don't ask for permission, I thought the character assassination of XQC, although definitely justified, was wholly irrelevant to the initial argument and especially with stands being lumped in with X and me being like the good guy, it just felt weird to like join in on that dunk session and be like, yeah, you know what? X is a fucking piece of shit and he does react bad and I do it right. It just felt wrong. Like I shouldn't get this big W. I didn't deserve it. Uh, and so I was just candidly surprised at the level of character assassination of XQC for the broader point of how this, this React meta is bad, I expected much more, and there still was a lot of this, much more just like very by-the-book analytical like uh, distillation of why this React meta is illegal or whatever. Uh, so that, that was it. That was why I felt like I needed to be more defensive Rather than sitting on my high horse and being like, yeah, he did say homophobic shit during Overwatch League. Fucking fucker. Yeah. You know what? This is like that. It feels as somebody who's done a lot of this shit like wrong. Uh, but I, I don't think the words that I said to express that in the moment were also right. I think they were also wrong. Like I think like you can't totally criticize him for that. That's fine. Um, that's like... But but in the context of criticizing him for it because reacting is bad and he's a reactor, it makes less sense to me. Uh, especially when it felt like, hey, there's people who are doing bad stuff like Stans, uh, Asmin Gold, and you know whoever else they use an example. Here's the main bad person, XQC. He's doing this. This is why it's bad. And so that's maybe why I felt also overly attached. Anyway, that was it. And, and and I and I wrapped it up saying it would be very easy to be like yeah fuck X in bandwagon and pretend I'm the good guy here, but again like, let's be real, I I have been doing React content in the past without any permission of stuff that I definitely like probably shouldn't be reacting to. I did like anime movie nights before during the subathon. I did a bunch of movie nights. You know, I watch entire shows. Like, I think I've become more ethical, but, like, I didn't get permission from every one of these TikToks. I didn't get permission for these group of rarest items on Earth. Like, I, th I try to operate with a sense of, you know, justice. I watch Code Lyoko. Yeah. We watched that one show that you guys were mad at me because I never finished. Um, I try to operate with a sense of justice. I only try to do that, by the way, because I'm at a position where I can, too, right? Like, if I was still a... 200 viewer Andy and I couldn't break out of that area I probably would not be considering the ramifications of me reacting and re-uploading content from other creators 
I just, I just candidly, I don't think I would be, which is why I feel like maybe that's why I was pushing back more than I would if I was totally detached. When did you watch Code Lyoko? It was a while ago. The Colony. That's it. The Colony. Uh, you missed Don't Know? $50 from Lawless Guy. You should try some of the new Fortnite creative maps. Perhaps me and Squeaks will play some Fortnite. Uh, thank you, Bri, for the membership. Channel name here. Enjoy your content, love. Thanks for the entertainment. Also, have you tried Trap Bar Deadlifts? Is that like the Hex Bar? Is that what that is? Did you see Hans Neiman Piers Morgan interview? No, God no. No, I look. It might not come as a shocker. I don't choose to spend my free time watching Piers Morgan. <laughs> what I do spend to choose it watching is usually Tyler One playing chess through like the Tyler One tracker, or Liam going for one twenty star with um, carpet list. That's what I watch these days. Uh, anyway, next. Major event canceled. Stream tomorrow, Wednesday. This was, I posted this on my Instagram. Haven't streamed for a few days. A major event I was planning out canceled. I'll talk about it on stream tomorrow. Have a good night. And then I posted, I looked up coots. This is a cooter duck. Uh, it's definitely the event you're thinking of. Yeah. It, we talked about this today already. It's chess boxing. We know. Uh, jet lag. We're going to watch jet lag today. I have it pulled up already. At least episode two. I don't know about three. We'll see. We'll see for the time. Uh, but yeah, jet lag. What's the comment saying? Dude's not finishing Japan though. Come on, man. I just, it didn't hook me as much. I don't like him either, but it was probably the funniest interview I've ever watched. Really? Is it actually worth watching? I mean, maybe I'll watch it if it's funny. What's your favorite type of fish to get on sushi? I like, I like salmon. I like Toro. I like yellowtail. Not to be parasocial and farm vulnerability, but I have been watching since... Old Among Us videos, and my life is better for it. Thanks, man. Look, don't say not to be parasocial. You can just say the thing. It's fine. I am your friend. I love you, Remy. <laughs> I love you. Uh, $30 from Brycey. Brycey, stop giving me money. You're over 100 Lud, one more thing. Could you see yourself commissioning freelance software developers to work on proprietary stuff for you in the future? Probably not. I have a full-time dev, auto. And I don't have enough work for auto, I think, as it is. Devs can do a lot, you know? Uh, all right, back to it, back to it, back to it. Anyone else miss the Lud Slime Valorant streams? Maybe I've been under a rock, but I feel like it's been a while since I've seen our favorite duo hit the slot machine queue. I got on Valorant train really late, and as a new player, I learned a lot from watching them. <laughs> oh, wow. You must be the worst Valorant player in the world. <laughs> Dude, that's tough. That's like saying you got your deadlift form from Joe Biden. You got your politics from Vivek Rondaswamy. Yeah. I'm so sorry. <laughs> More importantly, I miss the hilarious interactions between them. They're electric. Would love to see the Yard Boys featuring Yingling, Dawson, Five Stack. Well, okay, I'm against Five Stacking. I'm against playing with anybody who's a higher rank than me. Straight up, because I get called carried, and I want to solo queue to Diamond or do a queue with people who are equal or worse than to me. And I don't like playing Valorant on stream, because Valorant chat is the worst. Valorfrogs are the most oppressed group in the Ludbud community. Nope, it's actually pregnant Valorant frogs. Usually it comes in waves. The cycle is he'll get the Valo itch, go through watching MXS or slime streams. He'll play games with slime and frag out, fly air coots, fly feel strongman. Then one night he'll solo queue, he won't be feeling it, drop a stinker. Then he reads some dipshit first time chatter calling him dog shit. He'll say Valo chat is toxic and he'll never play Valo again. Valo frogs star for one to two months. Repeat cycle. No, that's no, no, okay? Here's the facts. Valorant is boring to watch. True, all right? It's not a debate. It is outright true, all right? And the reason it's boring to watch is because it's overdone, all right? I'm not calling out names here, but every goddamn variety streamer under the sun since Among Us died has gone to the well of, no, oh, just play Valorant. When they don't know what the fuck to do. And so mid-level Valorant has an insane supply. Such a huge supply that the demand is gone. Because you can tune in to any MF or stream and see subpar Valorant gameplay always on every single corner. It's just, it's just, it, it's just the case. It's just how it goes. 
you know, and it can be fun. Like if you do it in some cooler way or, you know, you do like, hey, versus pros or you add some sort of additional stakes or maybe some in-house that's exciting. But like it's as creative as just booting up League of Legends or booting up Fortnite. Like it's not I think it's just generally lazy content. And, uh, and I like doing it because I just like increasing my Valorant rank. And I don't like playing games offline because I should be doing other stuff offline. So doing it online takes the time away. But here's what happens. I play Valorant, views drop by 30% instantly. <laughs> Bang. Okay? Whatever. I don't care. I'm trying to play Valo. The chatters who are nice, who like Valorant, instantly do this, right? I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you. This is me taking the window, dragging it to my second monitor. Uh-huh. And then on their first monitor, they're going to look at the thing that they like to look at, the fun thing that they want on their main monitor. Because of that, they are no longer typing in chat. Chat rolls to a, a, a molasses pace. So slow, in fact, that people will tune in and being like, chat's kind of slow tonight. <laughs> chat's kind of slow tonight. Hell, huh, fellas? Like they're a fucking trucker pulling up to their favorite gas station. Slow night, eh? Slow night, eh? Hmm. Huh? And then, MFers who are pulling up the stream just for like five minutes, who are watching the gameplay and see me die, they're like, dog shit. Terrible aim. Too low. Holding the angle too low. Crosshair too low. Bad crosshair. Bad movement. You're not entering. You're baiting your team. Bad tatchels. Lamau. Lamau. You're bad. This is Platt? This is plat. <laughs> this is plat. This is plat. Oh, kill me where I stand. And those become, and it's not me getting one guide. Because I don't get fucking one guide. I don't get one guide because I am good at ignoring them. It is most of chat. Because the rest of chat is just slow. Because what the fuck are you supposed to say when I'm playing Valorant? Great job, Bloodwig. <laughs> you got an amazing 2K there. Wow. What a treat. All you're doing is occasionally dropping an LOL or a LMAO or some emote equivalent if something funny happens, occasionally. Or maybe an Omega lol if I'd get fucked. Or maybe a Pog if I do something good. That's it, uh, man. So anyway, chat's miserable. I'm miserable because I play worse on stream. Wish he could shut out those one guys. It's not one guys! It's not one guys! Oh my god. Oh my god. <sighs> Valo viewers, this guy's smart. Valo viewers like watching Valo streams while playing Valo or go on their phone. So chat is dead except for randos who come in and talk mad shit. Then I get tilted and play worse and lose my sweet rank points. Better, in my opinion, to play offline because I only stream like 100 hours a month. Anyway, Valo feels like wasted hours. 100 hours, buddy, you barely clear 70. Okay. <laughs> I've never streamed less than 70 hours since I switched to YouTube. That's false. False. Literally getting one guide on Reddit. I'm not getting one guide because 164 people upvoted it. I'm getting 164 guide. Hold up. Cutie messaged me. Shoo! Am I the problem? Me yesterday. Give it up for day three of Lud telling us he would stream, then he's not streaming. Me today. Still waiting for stream, but actually feeling a little guilty about it. <laughs> yeah, look, I'm not, I'm not happy that I was not streaming a lot. I wanted to stream, but I simply couldn't because I was wrapped up with dealing with chess boxing. Which was not, you know, like I wanted to be live, man. I wanted to fucking be live. Big Horrible with the big check mark says, This is deranged and no one cares. Is this Slime's alt? <laughs> Reactors of the Galaxy. Charlie. Asmin. Ludwig. Sniper Wolf. X. Tim the Tapman. Ninja? This is a wild group. Stands in the Legal Eagle video. <laughs> Poor stance. Poor stance catching strays. Welp, there it is. <laughs> You're probably wondering how I got here. Man, sucks to see after such a great event last year. I know tickets hadn't gone on sale, so I wonder if there was a logistical issue like not getting f enough fighters in time. I did get enough fighters. 
Well, postponed, not canceled. Well, okay, hopefully postponed, to be clear, right? Like, I don't have, I still don't have a sanctioned event. I do need that. Um... All right, boys, today the plan is shrimple. Okay, I think that's enough of the subreddit for today, no? Oh, some people had concerns about the truffle sidebar. Oh, cool, To Oh, this doesn't work for Twitch channel. Some people thought the sidebar was a bit intrusive. There's a sidebar that's for truffle if you're using the experimental mode. Uh, and there's actually a response. Austin is the lead dev of um, <clears throat> truffle. Uh, and he replied... And explain, what, one, why you're seeing the bar, two, why the decision was made, uh, three, how to resolve it, uh, which is cool. So, Austin, good guy, proactive. We like that. Uh, all right. <laughs> Next segment. Okay, so I asked 100 YouTubers for stream ideas. Uh, this video will probably end up coming out tomorrow or the day after. Uh, but I didn't do all the ideas. I, in fact, I missed a couple banger ideas. Banger ideas. Please read balls. New Hampshire stand-up. Longtime viewer sending mad love. Oh, by the way, I have a New Hampshire merch drop that comes out in a couple weeks. You might have seen my fanny pack uh, on my Instagram or just me wearing it in person. It's this fanny pack right here with the the face. This is a, this is actually a mogul moves fanny pack. I don't think I have it right here. Uh, but yeah, we have a mogul moves or excuse me, a New Hampshire merch drop coming. It's not specifically in New Hampshire. The merch drop is New Hampshire based. You know, old man on the mountain. It's actually a really dope merch drop. I mean, but I also fuck with New Hampshire, and I think New Hampshire is that. Grow your build like the Monopoly thimble. Oh, not. That makes no fucking sense. That makes no sense. I'm not. It's a it's a damn thimble. <laughs> it makes no sense. Swift. No. Um. All right. Back to it. So what was I saying? Oh yeah, one of the ideas. One of the ideas that I thought was really good. Hey lad, have you heard of Truffle.vip? I heard they just redesigned their website. I heard it looks better than ever, baby. One of the big differences, or excuse me, one of the ideas that somebody sent me, it was something that I was uh, nervous to do, a little embarrassed to do in a way, okay? Because there's... <sighs> there's a fact about me that I haven't told people yet. I'm actually French. Um, most of my family is born in France, and I'm actually fluent in the language. I don't like to talk about it because it's like my personal life or whatever. But some people found out about this, and somebody even suggested for my 100 YouTubers idea stream to test my French. So today, we're going to see just how amazing my French is by taking a French test to prove that I am fluent in the language or wildly embarrass myself in the process.
So let's take a look. Let's take a look at this test. Let's try it here together. Uh, starting out with our first question. Brain age thinking music. It's not going to be the IQ test all over again. Uh, okay, so the test is in French. And it's going to be a mixture of grammar and other things. Selectionnez le mot adéquat pour compléter la phrase suivante. Okay, select the word that is adequate to complete the following phrase. Hello, man. Hello, mister. Blank, the journalist? Hello, mister. Are you the journalist? Okay, so tu es. You are the journalist. Bam. Select the word to finish the phrase. Marguerite est blank au restaurant. Marguerite is the server. Oh, fuck. So this is a verb. So it wouldn't make sense to say is serve the restaurant. I think it's server. I don't know what servusy is. I don't think servusy is a thing. Select the word that is adequate to complete the phrase. Est-ce que tu vois blank voiture noire? Do you see the black car? Wait, okay. Est-ce que tu vois? Wait. Est-ce que tu vois la voiture noire? I mean, that's probably that, right? Select the word to finish your following phrase. Blank ton numero de telephone. Blank your phone number. What is your phone number? Probably, right? Quel est, quel est ton numero de telephone? Oh, shit. Numero de telephone. Tone. Tone. Tone, not ta. So masculine. That's masculine. So let's go with quel est. Or is it son? Because it's like, what's your numbers? Quel son ton numero? No, quel est ton numero de telephone? Let's go with that. Uh, finish the following phrase. Je te présente blank frère et blank ami. I present blank brother and blank friend. Je te présente mon frère et son ami. Je te présente mon frère et mon ami. Mon ami frero. I think that's right. Wait. Yeah, it's my friend and his friend. My brother and his friend. Okay, let's do it. Seleccionez le mot adequate pour compléter la phrase. Est-ce que tu as fait blank tennis hier? Did you, did you play the tennis yesterday? Oh, hold up. Cutie's blowing up my phone. All right, got it. Um, Est-ce que tu as fait le, de, le tennis? Did you do the tennis? Est-ce que tu as fait du tennis? Is it du, de le? I, I feel like le is weird. I'm not cheating. I was messaging cutie. Guys, I'm not cheating on a French test. I don't need to cheat. I think it's du. Seleccionez le mot adequate. Okay. Il est... 15, 15. That's three hours and 15. So it's 3, 15. Il est 3 heures moins le quart. No. Il est 3 heures et quart. That's it. Um, okay, finish the phrase. Je viens... Okay, I come from Germany. Je viens d'Allemagne. I think it's D apostrophe. Uh, so finish the following phrase. I'm going to Portugal. J'y vais au... I think with an X. I think it's this. I think it's that. I think it's that. That's like what you say for a friend's house. I don't know, though. Uh, finish the following phrase. El plural chant à la chorale du village. Great. Uh, il plural blank this song. Il chante cette chanson. They sing, they sing the song. That makes sense? 
Ce film est terrifi... This film is terrifying. J'ai... Hungry? Want? Fear? Thirsty. Fear. Um, J'ai peur. C'est après-midi, nous blank le musée de beaux art. Okay, this afternoon, we are going to visit the Museum of Beautiful Art. This stupid American is butchering our language in front of Tuzan. Okay. Rira stuit tout aussi bad de l'histoire poétique, mais brichot de Goliath in que pour vous. Okay, so uh, first of all, it's allons visiter because nous allons, allons is the conjugation for new. That's the conjugation, ONS. And then if you have a conjugated verb followed by another verb, the second verb is unconjugated. And so the verb is visiter, unconjugated. So nous allons visiter. Blind, b b bang. Bang. Uh, do you want to sleep with me? <laughs> oh, no. Wait, that's not what it is. This is, do you want to sleep at my place? Okay. I thought it was, tu veux dormir avec moi. Okay. Voulez-vous coucher avec moi? Peut-être? Je pas. C'est possible qu'on peut faire ça. Okay. Tu veux dormir chez moi? At my place. Uh, okay. Let's finish following phrase. Tu as dit à Romain. What did you say to Romain? Qu'est-ce que tu as dit? Qu'est-ce que, qu que tu as dit à Romain? Yes. Qu'est-ce que? Donnez-moi un kilo uh, de pommes de terre. Okay, give me a kilo of pommes de terre, and it's it's multiple, so let's go de. I think. Pourquoi tu ne m'écoutes pas? Pourquoi tu ne me écoutes pas? Isn't it me apostrophe? Oh no, it's new. That's why there's no apostrophe. Pourquoi tu ne Pourquoi tu ne nous écoutes pas? Nous sommes tes parents. Wait, no, that doesn't make sense. That doesn't make sense though, right? Because wouldn't it be pourquoi tu ne pourquoi tu ne nous écoutes? Is it écoutes? It wouldn't be with that conjugation, right? Ah, fuck it. Sebastian is talking to Anne, and Anne is a girl. Sebastian L. Parle. Wait, is it L? I think it's L, right? Sebastian L. Parle. No, S Sebastian lui parle. That's a guy. Sebastian L. Parle. No, wait. Sebastian se parle. Se? Se seems right. No, L. L. I think Louise guy, L's girl, I think. Tomorrow, we blank doing a boat. Nous sommes allés. Demain, nous sommes allés. No. Nous étions? Nous allons? What the fuck? No. I think it's sommes allés. Som sommes allés comme. Uh, je suis demandé à ma mère de venir. J'ai demandé à ma mère de venir. Yes, I asked my mom to come. The past tense. Elle blank de la maison. She left the house. Elle est sortie de la maison. No, wait. Is it elle est sortie de la maison? Fuck, can I go back? No! Kill me! Kill me! No! Shit! Dog shit! That's so dog shit! Fuck! Oh, it's probably a vousette. Okay, it was server. It was... Est-ce que tu vois la voiture? Uh, quelle est? Uh, putain! Putain de merde! Comme tu me fais chier là! Alright, hold up, pause. Je te présente mon frère et son ami. Est-ce que tu as fait le ten du tennis? 3h15. Uh, je viens d'Allemagne, au Portugal. Chante, elle chante, il chante. Peur, allons visiter. Dormir chez moi. Qu'est-ce que c'est? Des pommes. Oh my God! This is such a pos, pos. I'm telling you, Sebastien. 
elle parle. Demain, nous sommes allés. Je suis... J'ai demandé... Elle... She left the house. Elle a sorti... There we go. Okay, we're back. We are so back! Mon voisin... Blank son chien trois fois ce matin. My cousin... Blank your dog three times this afternoon. <laughs> that is... That is sus. No, my neighbor. Voisin's neighbor. My neighbor... A sorti son chien. My neighbor let out their dog three times. Mon voisin... On sorti... Was it on sorti? No, I think it's a sorti, I don't know. Okay, you want chocolates? Oui, j'en veux. It, he's going to Marseille. Oui. Fil, f, Felix, fil, Felix, 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 y va. Felix, on va. On va? Felix, y va? Je sais pas. Oui, Felix, on va. Uh, blank, écoutez-moi quand je te parle. Listen to me when I talk. Écoute, écoute-moi quand je te parle. Je connais bien cet homme et sur la photo. I know the guy on the picture. Je connais bien cet homme qui est, who is on the photo. Beatrice is a friend who I like. Of course, the American would want a chocolate. <laughs> it's, okay, it's part of the question. C'est mon parapluie. It's my parapluie? Is that an umbrella? It's it's my umbrella. It's mine! C'est... C'est le mien. C'est mon parapluie. C'est le mien. To buy the medication, you must go to the pharmacy. Pour acheter des médicaments, il faut aller à la pharmacy. Pour acheter, pour acheter. Is it pour acheter or pour acheter? No, pour acheter. Uh, I live in France for six years. J'habite en France depuis six ans. Okay. Quelques années, je suis allé en vacances au Mexique. Uh, depuis quelques années. Il y a quelques années? Depuis quelques années? No. There are years where I go to Mexico. Yes. When I... Je, quand j'étais plus jeune... When I was younger, je blank tout le weekend. When I was younger, I skied every weekend. When I was younger, j'aurais skié... J'aurais... Je skierai. Skierai. J'ai skié. C'est j'ai skié, non? Je. J'aurais skié. Quand j'étais plus jeune, j'ai skié. But it's, it, it wouldn't make sense if it's je ai. Ah, oh, whatever. Julien est parti en voyage hier. Il avait réservé son vol sur Internet. Julian left for his trip yesterday. He booked his flight online. Il avait... Il, réser, il réservait... Il réserve son vol sur Internet. He left yesterday, so he booked it online. Il est parti en voyage. Il avait réservé... I think that's right. Fuck if I know. Excusez-moi, madame. Je veux essayer une autre taille, s'il vous plaît. Excuse me, ma'am. I would like to try another size, please. Je voudrais. Ouh, tu sais, je ne pense pas qui vient à ta fête. Qui était à ta fête. Oh, you... Oh, tu sais... Oh, you know, I didn't think about who was at your birthday. Who's coming to your birthday? Who's coming to your party? What the fuck does that mean? Oh, tu sais, je... Oh, tu sais... Oh, you know... Je ne pense pas qu'il... Oh, I don't think he's coming. Je ne pense pas qu'il vient à ta fête. I don't think he's coming. 
I think it's right. Or maybe it's past tense. Oh, tu sais, je ne pense pas qu'il était à ta fête. Qu'il était. Si, je suis sûr que Marie vient ce soir. I'm certain that Marie is coming later. Oh, come, viendra. Oh, future tense. Fuck. No, maybe it's bien. I'm certain. Ha! I don't know. I don't know, man. I don't know. Si, si. Yes. Je suis, je suis sûr que Marie vient ce soir. I think it's just bien. Mais, mais je suis sûr que Marie viendra ce soir. Non, I think vient ce soir. Ah! Je viens, tu viens, il vient. Viendra ce soir. Uh, if I won the lottery, I would buy a big boat. Si je, si je gagnais au loto, j'achèterais... Un grand, un grand bateau. J'achèterai. Seems good to me. Je travaille en de la musique. I, I work while listening to music. Je travaille en écoutant de la musique. Okay? It's 40 questions, Robinson. Il fait que tu fais atten il faut, il faut que tu fais at attention à ta grammar. You must pay attention to your grammar. Il faut que tu fasses. Il faut que tu feras il faut que tu fasses rien. Il faut que tu. Il faut que tu fasses. Il faut que tu. Il faut que tu fais. Il faut que tu fais. Il faut que tu fasses attention. Mais fais attention. Fais attention. Fais fais attention. I think it's fast. Fais attention. Si je serais un oiseau. If I was a bird, I would fly under trees. Mais si j'étais un oiseau. Je volerai par-dessus les arbres. Si je serais, si j'étais, si je serais, serais, j'étais. I think it's probably serais. Well, si j'étais. Non, j'étais. I would say this. I think it's wrong, though. Ah! Okay, wait, 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 wait. You got 27 out of 40 questions answered correctly. You're... Approximate level is intermediary, A2 to B1. What does that mean? What does that mean? Oh my god, I had such an, a fucking cold streak at the end. J'achèterai, viendra, oh was, and it was viens with an E. Fuck, I think I did the masculine version. Skier, what is that, skier? Que Beatrice est une amie que j'adore. Qui j'adore? Que j'adore? Oui, Felix, il va. Elle est sortie de la maison. Nous irons faire du bateau. Sébastien lui parle. Oh, yeah, because it's Sebastian. He's talking. I guess it doesn't matter if it's a girl. What does this mean? A2 to B1, chat. Is this good? French, A2 to Tout B1. Sûr. Sacré bleu. Luvid you bring disgrace to le peuple québécois tabarnak de calice. C'est un bon effort quand même. Wait. C2 is the highest level. A1 is the lowest level. I'm one above the lowest level? I'm considered elementary? This student needs to continue working on sentence building as well as new grammar points. Omelette du fromage. A B1 learner will allow the student to work on challenging grammar points, such as imperfect and conditional tense. Oh, what the fuck?
A B2 learner should be able to have spontaneous conversations with a native French speaker, watch TV shows with minimal disruptions. They'll be able to read complicated text and express their points of view on a number of different topics and form, form complex arguments. I'm one away from that! I probably couldn't do all that, to be honest. Bro talks like a toddler? That's not bad. Wait, if I could talk like a toddler in every language, I would do that. That's like pretty tight. Cheated and still won't pass lol. You got a 67%? That's a D? Okay. It's hard. I mean, that test was hard. That test actually was exactly like AP French, though. Literally set up the same exact way with like Ella, conditional Ella sentences. I'm literally doing French too humble right now. French? Dude, I don't know. I... I, this is not a hot take. This is an ice cold freezing take. I think what we learn in schools is so horse shit, dog shit bad. <laughs> and and it, I don't blame the teachers. Like my mom is a foreign language teacher. They just stretch students so thin. They have them come in at way too fucking early. So they don't actually give a shit because it's more daycare than it is a learning experience. And then they have the students doing all the classes, and so they're not specialized in any of them. They're just kind of dog shit at all of them. <sighs> Even PE sucks. Like, I feel like if you go through PE and you don't know how to, like, properly do deadlift or properly run or properly do a pull-up or properly stretch your ligaments, but you just play dodgeball and throw out your shoulder, like... It's crazy, man. Maybe you just sucked at school. I don't think people who are good at school are necessarily that well-rounded, though, you know? Like, I think they're just good at school, which is, like, valuable because it teaches discipline, hard work, whatever, but depends. Maybe maybe there are schools that are better. I ate my rap. It was good as shit. Why is he drinking out of two cups? I got a coffee cup and a water cup. Do Duolingo Japanese? I have been. So if you guys didn't know, uh, we're going to watch that like in a little bit. But uh, Connor announced it finally. Sea Dog VA. I'm bringing it back. The RV trip is coming back bigger and better. Gamers, I'm bringing it back. The RV trip is coming back bigger and better than ever, with five days of streaming this time and more guests and even merch. You are definitely going to want to make sure you don't miss this. We'll be starting around roughly these times in all the time zones on screen right now. 5 p.m. Pacific, 8 p.m. Eastern. So I'm, I'm going to be your nighttime show. On the 6th of October, Japan. 5th for you Americans. So get your chalky milk ready in your blankets for a cozy week of some fun RV shenanigans. Ludwig is making hella bread, so y'all really can't say shit. That's dumb. I think if someone's making hella bread, you can still say shit to them. I think bread is oftentimes a replacement for success, and it shouldn't be. I think rich people are oftentimes not rich because they're, like, better, smarter, or more, like, successful. A, a lot of the times it's, like, you know, luck birth conditions, etc. It's still chill to disagree. It, but, you know, I don't blame you for also thinking that. I think it's a very natural trans... Like, I think what naturally happens is people want to get rich so then they can be like, you can't fuck with me because I have all this wealth. I am above you. And then they realize that's not the case. Then I think people chase, like... I mean, this is not everyone, but I think there's, like, an ego chase of, like, having an insanely fucking ripped-ass body. That way, if anyone talks shit, you could beat them in a 1v1. I'm basically talking about the Jake Paul, Logan Paul pipeline. <laughs> and again, featuring some of your favorite guests, such as Premier 2 and Ludwig, and some not-so-favorites. Look forward to seeing you guys there. Gamers! I'm doing the RV stream! So anyway, I'm going to be doing Connor's RV stream chat. It's like a few days long. It's in Japan. I'm excited for it. I've been practicing my Japanese. And by practicing my Japanese, I mean I've been learning hiragana. I don't actually know what any of the words mean. But I can read the characters. I'm actually kind of nasty. Select the correct character for Koma. This is Ko. This is Ma. Koma. Maki. Maki. This is ma. This is ki. Maki. 
Ready? I got this shit easy. This is shite. Shite. This is fucking soda. Soda. This is mayu. Mayu. This is hama. Hama. This is tetsu. Tetsu. Tera. Tera. Te. Ra. Ra. The, I can't say the ra shit. I feel like I'm rolling my R like a Spanish person. Terra, terra, but it, it's not like that. It's weird. Satsuma, okay, but it's like Satsuma. Sa I don't know how to say him. Satsuma. <laughs> uh, okay, we got sa. This is tsu. This is ma. Satsuma, masaka. Masaka. Okay, great. We got masaka. Masaka. We got uh, katsura. Katsura. We got. Mashite? Mashite? Yeah. We got has Hashira? Hashira? Masaka? Masaka? Ha mm, hama 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 ha 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 None of them. Like, I can read it out. Like, I'll be in Japan. I'm going to see a sign. I'm going to be like, oh, my God, Matsuri. And then I'm going to be like, what does that mean? I got nothing. This one means festival, I guess. Hakama. Hakama. Ha uh, Hakama. I try to try to say it when I do it. Like, the TTS will do it. Hakama. 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 <laughs> Hakama? Tamaki. Tamaki. Ta tamaki. Okay, this is easy. Tamaki. Tamaki. Uh. Soshite. That's how they're gonna say it. Soshite. 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 <laughs> Makite. Makita. Fuck. Uh. Ha ha hasa 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 hasama hasama. Hasama. Katsura. Katsura. Kamata. Kamata. Katsura. Great. Great. Ka. Ka. Katsura. Tsu. Tsu. Ra. Ra. Ba ba. Uh, Matsuri. Easy. Fucking free as D and B. Satsuma. Satsuma. Also free because this is Satsuma. They had a Sashima on there. They're trying to throw me off. Uh, Masaka. Ha, 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 sama. So, 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 this ne. So, tetsu. So, shite. Matsuri. Hantai. 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 Ooh, a four character one. Bam, bro. That's just me 15 days in that bitch. Hentai. Hentai. Hentai Jozu. Anyway, I know nothing more than I did when I went last time. I just know a bit of how to read the hiragana. Beep, 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 beep. Yeah, Duolingo is a lot of shit. I'll give you that. I play it on the side when I die in my Valo solo lobbies. Hold up, it's a beeping. I gotta get it. It's not Ray's dream coming true. Holy shit. Oh, that's the old one. Your title says come watch uh, me. I just wanted to say no. Have a good day. <laughs> Thank you, the $5. Epic Gamer. New Hampshire stand up. Appreciate that again. Thank you, the captain, for the membership. 
Uh, all right, chat. Before we watch jet lag, because uh, after jet lag, we almost assuredly end. Oh, uh, yo. Yeah. Wait. What the hell is going on on this stream? I can catch this. I catch this right here. What is going oh, it's on? Cool. You can't. It's the same route. No. -uh. Who is that? What's going on? I have no regrets. I love this game. I don't feel bad about it at all. What was I gonna do? Imagine what I would be like without WoW. How is CS2 going? Are people enjoying it? Come in. How's the game, big guy? You can't make the mid to cat jump though. You can. I can. Why is there a random dude in my house right now? Okay. Sounds like a beta. How's the games? They've been easy. But there's no MMR, Lud. How you doing, Lud? No, you you want to get in here? I think we have five though. Estate, at least in 2024. Well, have you met Mo Ludwig? This year, just fucking let's chalk this year off to a, <laughs> a, a, a loss. Let's just move on. 2024. You gotta start your real estate portfolio, bro. You Not falling for that shit. Not here. falling for that? Falling for what? Mo dick in your mouth. Mo dick in your mouth. No, his name is actually Mo. Yeah, nice, bro. buddy. Yeah, buddy. God I damn bet. it. He's fucking, he's baked. He's baked. I bet sure. it's How Mo, many gummies, bro. bro. How many gummies you at? I'm not big. Oh, has a six month pump. Okay, am I crazy? Or has Tarek, ever since he started taking Trend, TRT, and steroids, been wearing nothing but stringers? Like, did he throw out the t shirts? <laughs> Are they just gone? I swear to God, Tarek started going to the gym, started wearing nothing but stringers, and then doing this. I don't know what's going on with the back of the dude's head, but he needs head and shoulders, so he stops reaching back there. Swear on my mom's life, every time I tune in, he does one of these. <sighs> oh, fuck, Chad, I gotta go get some water. I gotta get some... I got, uh, Chad, I gotta go to the bathroom. It's back there. Oh, man. Oh, CS2. CS2 came, CS2 came out. That's crazy, dude. The thing is, he looks damn good. I know he knows what he's doing. He's thirst trapping on his stream these days. Says you. I hate wearing tanks on stream. If I wear a tank top on stream, you guys, the whole stream go like, people just tune in you're, and they just say it. They're like, tank top. <laughs> tank top. He tank top, tank top, tank top. You're wearing a tank top. And I'm like, yeah, I know I'm wearing it. You're like, tank top. It's like, okay. All right. Leaving for the Air Force in less than two weeks. I'm going to miss your stream so damn much. Connor! Hey, man. Have a fucking fantastic time in the Air Force. I hope you uh, receive life lessons that are positive for the rest of your days. And I hope th that th is it. And that's it. It's all positive all the way through, baby. Challenge yourself, you know? Do something... Do something you didn't think you would do. I mean, joining the Air Force is probably something you didn't think you would do, I imagine. Get crazy with it, baby. Uh, chat. Okay. Oh. Hey, Lud, it's my birthday, and I found out it's also Squeaks' birthday as well. It is Squeaks' birthday today. He turns 30. Or maybe 30. Or maybe 40? I genuinely don't know how old he is. I just know he's older than me, and so I stop caring. I don't plan on playing Baldur's Gate on stream, I think. I think it's just a lot of time. Uh, by the way, speaking of Squeaks Chat, if you guys didn't see, I think it's actually in my subreddit. 
I'm not pushing 30, bro. I'm 28. Don't fucking come at me with that language. I am not close. I am not close. Uh, tomorrow, we're doing the 24-hour stream with Squeaks. This is our game plan. This is our game plan for the stream. 24-hour stream. Intro, 30 minutes. We're starting at noon Pacific, 3 Eastern. Bro vs. Bro. It's going to take us about three hours. Loser of that is going to do the Billy Billy Challenge for lunch. Only one restaurant. Let's chill. Then we're going to play a little basketball, some horse, one-on-one. -on -one. Then we're going to shower and vibe and chill and, and have fun. Then we're going to do a water tier list with expensive waters, fancy waters, regular waters. Then we're going to do poker 1v1. Then we're going to do painting Bob Ross. Mario won 20-star race, which Squeaks has never done before, so I think I might be able to win. Then we're, I'm going to reset because it's YouTube.com, and that's how that shit fucking work. We're going to do a couples compatibility quiz, do couples games like Rocket League, Wingman, and CS2, Played Up, Fall Guys, GeoGuessr, Fortnite. Then we're going to go sleep time. Maybe have some mods, play videos. We'll we'll see. Maybe we'll play all the way through it. Uh, then breakfast. We're going to do who's smarter uh, test. And then you laugh, you turn off the stream. So should be, uh, should be dope. Should be fun. When is that? Tomorrow. That's literally going to start in 16 hours. I'm not going to propose at the end. We're not doing 2v Thursdays with Foosley, I don't think. She has not hit me up about it, so I think they're just addicted to Minecraft full stop. I think that's it. They're just full stop addicted as shit to Minecraft, and that's all they do is play Minecraft day in, day out. I might join this Minecraft server. No! Oh, you had it. I had it. Maybe a different POV. I forgot to jump. Am I in the Minecraft server? I just forgot to jump. Ay, yay, yay. You know, you know what might be messing you up? The crouching tech, you don't have to do it. Anyway, I think I might join the server. She is terrible at parkour. You should jo uh, open another casino. <laughs> Auto! <laughs> Build a bunch of shit for me. Uh, all right. Should we jump now into a bit of jet lag? May schlaps. May schlaps do we jump to a bit of jet lag chat? Real quick, before we jump into jet lag... I'm going to give myself a challenge of very simply winning one ranked game of GeoGuessr. That way I'm worldly enough to get it done. Driving on the left side of the road. It's actually the right side of the road. Just looks like the left side of the road. It's not too wide of the license plate. It's kind of narrow in a way. This sign says something in a language. Prohibido estacionar. It's not legal to park there. Spanish. Spanish. Aldulo garage. Here's the facts. It's Spanish. It looks like US style license plates, which means we are in the great country of Mexico. And I'm feeling good about this. I'm pinching a tenta. I'm not even showing you guys the fucking gameplay. Bro, what is up with me? Yeah, we're in Mexico. It said tenta. I, I wasn't just talking about like me being hard because I thought I was slightly good at a video game. I swear it said tenta. It, it, now it's like I'm kind of embarrassed, but... Bolivia! Okay, well, it turns out I'm dumb. Thankfully, my opponent is dumber. I think I'm going to play Minecraft on Saturday. And by I think, I mean if I don't, I think uh, Myung will never talk to me again. We're in the nor We're in the southern hemisphere. I think we're in Australia. I think we're in the outback. I think we're in the freaking outback, man. I don't think we're in the Outback anymore. I instantly regret what I said. I don't think we're in the Outback. Are you going to TwitchCon this year? I think I am going to TwitchCon. P 
Picasso. Wait, he lives here? Where the fuck am I? Solo resid, 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 where the fuck am I, bro? Am I just in South Africa? The thing is, it feels. Tabare Sendik? What the hell? What is this language? It looks like Spanish or French. Maybe we're in Argentina. That could make sense because we're in the... So oh, flag. I think we're in South America. Because we're in the Southern Hem. And I see Spanish. Although that kind of looked almost Brazilian. I'm going to go right here. Yeah, I'm going to go to TwitchCon this year. Sneaking in at TwitchCon once again. No clue what I'm going to do, though. Ooh, good guess. It was Uruguay. Wait, that was a great guess. What the heck? I'm back. All right, let's guess a little faster. Driving on the right, we're in a European country, which there are too many of. Let's consolidate Europe. We're in Hungary. Hungry, hungry, hungry. I accidentally spent $15 trying to send you a clip of you doing the Tarek thing 15 minutes ago. <laughs> I don't do that. Please check out Bangers LLC in your server, please. I'll take a look. The Moist Moguls hat came in the mail today. My new favorite hat. Been an awesome one, Lud. Thank you, Zelazo. Uh, Sinbad said, just want to show my support and say thanks for all you've done for the Melee community. It's inspirational. Appreciate it. As a teacher, my best. As a teacher myself, we're doing the best with what we have. Oh, I know that. I would never blame a teacher. I think teachers are doing the best they with what they got. But facts are that teachers are not given a lot of tools. They're not given a lot of budget cuts. Or excuse me, they're giving uh, they're given a lot of budget cuts. They're oftentimes just told to switch up schedules, switching blocks, formats. It's tough to be a teacher. All right, then let me get in one chess game. Let me get the trifecta going. And then we're going to jet lag. I want to stay crispy at chess. Watching Tyler 1 play chess makes me want to play chess because I don't want to ever fucking lose to that motherfucker in a game of chess in my life. So I'm like trying to keep my skills sharp because this guy plays 10 hours a day. And he's pretty damn good. I wouldn't mind going back. If he does this, I think that's kind of good for me. Oh, he's going to do that. That's fine. I can attack kingside. I'll castle. I'll bring out knight. I could push. No, it doesn't make sense. How about... Dude, if I lost a Tyler 1 in chess, I actually think I would never stream again. <laughs> uh, He can't push, I don't think. Yeah, I'm happy with this. Because now I can push out queen if he decides to castle kingside. He might decide to castle queenside. Which would be a little weird with the pawn structure. It seems safe, though. Uh, Let's go here for now. I'm threatening a check here. He might... Oh... I didn't see that. I fucking hate myself for missing that. That was really dumb as shit. Yeah, that sucks. Oh my god, I'm so fucked. <laughs> That's a big oof. I ain't gonna lie at the level of oofitude. Bitch! Stop! Oh no. Son of a bee. Why are you taking all my pieces? Now he's going to try to offer a queen trade or something. Ludwig got grew up with cable television facial hair. 
Ludwig got grew up with Ludwig has the grew up with cable te television facial hair. What does that mean? I did grow up with cable television. What does that mean? What is it? What, what are you trying to say about my character? What does this mean? What does it mean? All right, let me let me go. Ah, oh, shit. Is he gonna go here? Threaten while threatening a checkmate. What? Oh my god. Shit, dude. Okay, it's a three minute time. I ate my wrap. Why does everyone keep asking me if I ate my wrap? I ate my damn wrap. If I take. Oh, Fuck this, dude. If I take, he's going to take with Knight. Oh, my God. That's so vile. What a vile motherfucker. Little bro, why are you shocked that you suck at French in your stream after coming home? You said people thought you were good because you talk like a little French five-year-old boy. Can you pause past Carmen? Shit. What do I do? I'm actually in an unwinnable spot right here. This is actually, un I actually think I've just, I, I, I think I'm like minus 5,000. How bad was that? Because that felt bad. I was minus 11 right here. God damn it. Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. So I know the Dutch. I go knight out. I go e6. Then I'm going to fianchetto my bishop. By playing b6, b7 with bishop. What are you doing? Let me instantly pin the, the knight. If takes, I will... Oh, shit. A double fucking pin, baby. Let's put pressure... Let's back this bishop out. Wait. This is easy. Take. Take. <laughs> yup. Yup. Hey, you snooze, you lose, baby. Oh, what the hell? Oh, God. What is he doing? What are you doing? Fuck. Get out of here. Get out of here! Threatening this piece? Yup. This is good for me still. This is good for me still. We're going to Fianchetto? Look at that. Look at this. Look at this! We're going to go here. We're attacking this. We're attacking this. He's going to see this. He's going to go, oh no, I'm going to attack your knight. I'm going to attack your knight with my rook. And then I'm going to throw my big fat rook. G2. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why was that the greatest move known to man? It wasn't because I get your fucking rook, baby. Uh, and then I can simply just play this, which will move the rook. So then I can play this, which is a check on the king. The king will go here. I will attack the bishop, which will support me for my check. King must move. Threatening checkmate. No, I'm not. Why'd I say that? Ooh. Shit. What do I do? 
Wait, what is this easy? I pinned the bishop to the king. Huh. This is okay. Let's move out my knight. Let's develop. Develop, develop, develop. Let's move our king. Oh, what are you doing to me? Let's get our other rook out. Okay, he's threatening this. Um, how do I stop it? Do I care to stop it? What are you doing to me? Okay, I really have to tighten up here. I have to tighten up. I'm running out of time. Monka W. Is that checkmate? <gasps> no! Uh-oh. What's he going to do? What's he going to do? He can't check me, can he? Interpose. Woo! Yep. The 1984 world. What the hell did that say? Wait, 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 wait. I had him crushed the entire time right up until this move. And then he had a mate in two. He missed a mate in two. I think it was check with the bishop. Which forces King's only move to be here. And then the resulting move after the forced move is a knight mate. <gasps> wow. That guy's dog shit. <laughs> alright, alright, alright. Final chess match. Final chess match. Okay, I always play E4. What if I get crazy and play D4? I've never played it in my life. I'll defend it. He's going for a fianchetto. I will push out. I will go bishop. Just a nice, you know, just a nice clap. I got a classy, classy little setup here. What do I do? I think I take. If takes, I take. Then, wait, hold up. One, two, three pieces are attacking. One, two are defending. Shit, did I fuck up? Dun, 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 dun. I think I fucked up. Fuck that. Damn it. What I do? I fucked up. If I take here, it sacks the queen. If I take with check, then queen must take. Why'd I do that? No, this is good. This is good for me. This is good for me. Oh, this is so good for me. Let's bolster. We're bolstering. Mm, mm, analyzing. Boom. Threaten. The fuck? Threaten both? Look at that. Woo! Skewered you. Skewered you. 
The next natural move is probably going to be, yup, so predictable. So predictable. Predictable. Um, let's, let us, let me, let me, let me. Maybe I go here. Let's go here. Let's cook a second. So if I go here, I bolster this. Then if I make this move, he can't go here. He can't go here. And he can't go here because I play this. He could go here. That's fine. We, we're, we're down on time. I need to play fast. I need to play smart. I need to play concise. Chat fell asleep, Ludwig. Come on. People don't hate it that much. Protected. What am I doing? What did I just do? Wait, this is actually kind of good for me. Fuck. Wait. <laughs> you fool. Time, 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 time. Oh, shit. I think I had that. I think I was winning. Ah, damn it. It was too hard with my time left. Yeah, I was crushing. And then I ended up drawing. Oh, three minutes so lame. All right, I'll end it. I'll end it. I'll end it. Two, 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 one, 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 one. I ended one, one, one. Nothing wrong with ending one, one, one. All right, I am ready for one jet lag after. Wallet. Calculator. Energy. World. Peace. Kill. Murder. Light. Uh, shine. Lamp. Fire. Torch. Flash. House. Technology. Light. Star. Bright. Bright light. Bright light lamp. Bright light lamp. Bright light lamp. Screen. TV. Phone, light, lightning, flash, bulb, 
like TV, TV, house, home, goods, buy, best, sell. I, okay, what am I doing here? It's a light screen lamp, iPad, <laughs> um, flash. No, that's already that down there. Camera? No, light screen lamp bright. A, I don't know, microphone? Microwave? A light, okay, a light, a light screen lamp, a lamp, a lamp, a lamp. Read, dark, night, uh, dark sea, sight, vision, eyes. <sighs> wow. Um, okay. Damn, a light screen lamp bright dark i see night something to see at night in your house that's light and it's like a flashlight wow okay samsung smart fridge fridge closer than i thought a bright screen a bright screen monitor pc a bright screen A light screen. Projector? A light screen. Pokemon? A light screen. Lamp bright. Lamp, lamp bright. Dim? Switch? Scary? Bed? Sleep? Bed was closest? Bed light. A night light! Glow, a, a bed light, a bed light. Read, book, a bed light? Bathroom, shower, toilet, showers close? Clean, dry, shower, bathroom, toilet, toothbrush, uh, hair dryer, blow, uh, window? Window? Sink? Wait, wait, wait. A, ba a bathroom? So a window, shower, bathroom? I don't get it. A, a window, shower, bathroom light. P. Piss. Moonlight. Moon. A window, shower, bathroom, light, bed screen. <laughs> what the fuck? Mirror! Oh. Um, sink? Soap? Shampoo? Table? What do you call it when you're at your brush? Like you're brushing your teeth and you're at the sink. I already have that. Um, Glass. No. Ceramic. Tile. Wow. Shower. Bath. Bathe. A window... Shower, bathroom, bedroom, living room, living, kitchen. It's something to do with the house. Water, heat, cold, cool, curtain. I took I took that from chat. Thank you very much to Avery. Avery. McFetridge. I stole your answer. All right, chat. It is time for Jet Lag Episode 2. Remember finding you from your vid playing Mango in Madden 05 years ago? Classic. Shout out for being Hello an and well content creator for the better part of five years. Big ups. Thanks, Phoenix. Appreciate you. All right, ready? Hello and welcome to episode two of this game of tag. Any advice for starting a YouTube channel for someone age 14 to 17? Start a YouTube channel. And then see how it goes. Don't wait for some piece of information to start a YouTube channel. You, that's just you creating mental blocks for yourself so you don't have to do the thing.
across hello all right ready let's do it hello and welcome to episode two of this game of tag across europe just as a quick refresher in this game we're each trying to get to a different place in europe whichever of us is the current runner can spend coins to make progress towards their location while trying to avoid capture from the chasers last episode on his way to zermatt switzerland ben ended up getting caught in moves a station in the middle of absolutely nowhere this made Adam the runner and gave him a massive opportunity. Using the reservation he had made as a chaser, he was able to get right back on the train he took in Moose before it left the station. That train is headed to Strasbourg, from which Adam can head north towards Germany to his location, Borkum. And to make matters worse for me and Ben, who now need to catch Adam, the next train from Moose to Strasbourg isn't for three hours, putting us dangerously far behind. Adam has just been gifted biggest lead this game has ever had what if it was sabotage and ben and adam are in cahoots uh chat if you guys don't watch jet lag it is like the amazing race there are three main characters to know sam the most knowledgeable but also injured this season so that's tough uh ben the best dressed and also plays the game and adam the most improved, I would argue. Uh, and Ben, I think, is in cahoots with Adam and gave him a great head start to get all the way to Germany. Well, why did you catch me here? Why did you go here? At the last station. That way, <laughs> there was a train one hour later to Strasbourg. But it doesn't stop here. But it doesn't stop here. Yeah, like only because the train stop here. Look not a fan of the blonde he cheeses too much they all look they all make the rules together actually ben and adam okay, make the so, rules um, they're all cool i've dipped into the little area between cars to explain the move basically i'm back on the train that sam and i were just on you're breathing heavy. to strasbourg i'm allowed to do that because we initially booked a reservation to strasbourg so i have to pay for it now but i'm allowed to get on it i have a reservation the thing is they can't get to strasbourg for three hours ahead. Yep. But, but only theoretically three hours ahead. You, what, you, you banking on a derail? This is ethical. I have direct permission from Wendover, a.k.a. Sam, to watch this. Lint? Well, we could call in a bomb threat. I just <laughs> Dude, they're on the BT wave? That's genius. See, that's what I would do if I was on jet lag. You start calling in a couple BTs and all of a sudden these punctual Japanese trains are going to halt to a stop. All right. And guess who shows up? But this guy, Jin. Oh, Wakata Mashita. There's a BT. Mm, too bad is what I would say. TB. This one. Fuck Ben is smart. A car that was like all children. Surely the children. Are not traveling the, alone. the children are All traveling alone. Together, They're right? traveling alone. Comment Adam. below if children have a special car or if that's just a band of very transit oriented children. Sounds like some Republicans to be scared of. Okay. The 24 hour squeak stream tomorrow um, at noon, Barry. So we have done some research. We thought we were extremely screwed, but it turns out that's what I heard possibly. Two thirds of extremely screwed. I mean, we looked at every option. We've just spent 40 minutes researching. Um, we wanted to see if we could basically cut Adam off. We looked at flights, we looked at trains, we looked at everything, and there's no way to really get ahead of him on his route north. So we have to just follow him, basically. And hope he loses time. Well, fortunately, it turns out if we go backwards back to Champaign-Ardenne, Champaign then we can take a slightly earlier train to Strasbourg and only be, what, like two hours two behind? Hours behind better <laughs> how does that make sense how does going back make you that's crazy we watch episode one yeah a few days ago train. i think literally bad. four days ago five days ago why is it shitting out pissing and fluting <laughs> an express train <laughs> you made All a friend? Right. Wait, Adam, Welcome you made a friend? Don't just glaze over that. I'm just going to get outside bon, the train bon station and then I'll explain me. my full plan. Au revoir. 
It'll be 2 p.m. CDT, Yoda. 1 p.m. Mountain. That music is fun. Let's just get across the street here. Play TF2. Oh, it's already starting to get hot. Perhaps. Thank you, the membership, CBC. We got toasty. Sam, would you believe that Adam Chase is in Strasbourg, France right now? I think I would believe that. It's so hot. It gets so hot in France. Uh, he's there. We should try and figure out what. Uh, 1246. 1246. 1246. That's his best train out of there. Yeah, so it is a bit of a while. I mean, it's going to rack up some points, no doubt. But... Yeah. All right, so here's the deal the goal is to get to Borkum. Uh, but it's very far. <laughs> Borkum so, is an insane name. I'll... I'm not totally going to focus on getting all the way up just. Ludwig, one day left on Earth. What song are you playing? I need to know for a school project. What? fucking deranged teacher do you have <laughs> all right kids i want you to go home i want you to find somebody that you watch someone whose content you consume ask them if they were to die pure death consuming them darkness the void in 24 hours what song would they listen to kiddos so let's let's get out there and remember no one too big to ask what how is that it's supposed to be family even worse even worse uh, I would pick, I would pick, okay, I'm gonna die. I got 24 hours to live. I gotta pick a song to listen to. I'm getting up there. I'm going, ooh, one day left. All you ladies pop your pussy like this. No, that's inappropriate. I would, I wouldn't do that. I would, I would, one day left. I'm there. I'm sitting. I'm like, ooh, what do I listen to? I need one song, and it's got to be a good one, because I'm going to perish. It's got to be my last one. Yep. Ah. No, I have it. Okay, here's what I would do. My final song that I would listen to is my arch nemesis, Lo-fi girl and I would only I would only die when the music stops And my heart would stop beating when lo-fi girls music stops playing Just yet I'm more focused on getting to Munster and I need to get on that train at 1246 So in about an hour and a half that's not to how this Munster, works. I need Oh, yeah, the much more realistic question that he asked. What, what do you mean? What do you mean it's not how it works? We get to make up how it works. It's a dumb hypothetical. <laughs> it, dumb hypotheticals beget dumb hypothetical answers. I did the math on it. 3,820 coins. I have 550 right now. So basically, I have an hour and a half to earn just over 3,000 coins. Which, doable, not super easy. Um... Who's in the so background? I think that what I'm going to do is Who's in the background? I'm going Cacklin. to buy the 250 coin power up that doubles the value of my next challenge, but it also doubles the veto period. So it would be very bad if I had to veto. Let's find out. Shuffle, shuffle. Congratulations, you're in Amy's trivia corner. Amy has recorded three trivia questions about Europe with increasing Oh, I get this easy. I get this easy. You have one guess at I get each answer. Easy. For each right answer, you yep. receive 400 yep. coins. There is no punishment for wrong answers in Amy's trivia corner. That's not how Amy rolls. This rocks. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. We love trivia. This is the best card in the deck. I am thrilled to be in Amy's trivia corner because there the is no veto for this card. All right. Let's see She's what's a staff in member store. of half as interesting. In Amy's trivia corner. Oh, by the way, if you didn't know, Amy is our colleague. She writes a lot of half as interesting videos and sometimes helps us with jet lag. Okay. I'm pre-watch. Welcome to Amy's trivia corner. Hi, Amy. Here's your first question. In 1911, a European painting was iconically stolen. So iconically that when the museum got it it's back Mona Lisa. years later, it's it was Mona way Lisa. more famous than it it's had ever Mona Lisa. been. I know so this. now, if you want to see it, you're going to have to brave some serious crowds. Yeah. I think it's the Mona Lisa. It's the Mona Lisa. I know this. That? It's the Mona Lisa. It, it is the, the Mona, Mona Lisa. Lisa. Thank you, Amy. Okay, awesome. So that right away, 800 coins. Second question. Do you want some pizza? 
pizza? Yeah, it's not really French, sure. is it? Well, well, boy, do I have some news for you. The pizza vending machine oh round two. God. Le shop oh. a pizza. That's an owl. I was so excited. <sighs> this rocks. Second question. The German language is full of tons of very useful, very specific words. Okay. Wanderlust, Schadenfreude, Torchloose Panic. Which of these is the definition of torchless panic? A, fear of looking like a tourist. B, oh, realizing wow. you left home without turning the lights off. C, anxiety caused by running out of time. B, B. Or D, a school or class that prepares children for the first grade. B. Torchless panic, panic of leaving the torch on. Torchless panic. Oh no, oh, I don't know this at all. Torch. Lust, panic. Okay, panic. Yeah, so sounding out, panic would be anxiety. So I don't think it's D. But torch sounds a lot like torch. And that would lead me to think it's about lights. So I feel like it's B. I'm going B. We're going both B. right. I We're both really so like right. I would like B, please. So the answer is B. No! Anxiety caused by running out of time. No! You wouldn't know anything about that, would you? This sucks. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Wait, it's fine. It's me fine. and Adam are like two peas in a Europe pod. Europe is a continent of many distinct flags. Which of these four flags is not the real flag of a European country? Oh, God. Bad. I think it's A or B. I think it's A. No, fuck. I think it's A. B is the Italian flag. C is another flag. D is another flag. I think A is like the Mexican flag, but like a little different. Oh, Jesus. A. One of them is Italy's. I know that for sure. It, it, B's oh, Italian. Oh, God. I think okay, D's I think like... that B is the Italian flag. D looks kind of familiar. Yeah, I forget D. It's something. C is something. It's A. It's between A and C. No, it's me. A. I'm going A, but I don't feel confident. The answer is A. Yes. Obviously, that look at it. Yup. Ridiculous. Yup. Possibly be real. Oh my God. Coins? Okay, that was incredible. so easy, bro. What a great so that pull. That is sixteen hundred coins right there. It's Wait, like half of what 16? I need. Sixteen? Sixteen? I thought it was eight hundred. Are you sure? <sighs> Thank you, Amy. Who needs human beings? They suck. They suck. I wish I could install one of those in my, my apartment. Welcome back to this episode of Choo 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 Derailed. Yeah, I don't like that you have. Oh, he used the double up power up. Oh my god, genius. Empire that we built. And you okay. didn't miss a snack cell now. No, I said no. You're live on Twitch? That's a perfectly serviceable pizza. Oh, no, no, no. And then they go. I'm not going to get a snack vending, a pizza vending machine in my next Amazon stream. I, I ain't doing Amazon stream okay. for a while. Well, that, that turned shit. out amazing. So that I shit's feel not like good. it's probably no longer worth the risk to double up again. Do it. Do it. I don't know. Do it. No. No, I'm going to double up. I'm yep. going to double up again. Going, I'm trying to earn coins right now. Yes. Focusing on coins. It's We're in our shuffle, bag era. Shuffle. Cut an orange in half using only this card. Acquire an orange. Using only this card, fully cut the orange in half. Easy. You cannot pry the orange open using your hands or the card. Wait, that's easy. Uh, unless the card gets soggy. I think that's easy, though. Okay. 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 We have tested this. It is doable. It is not exactly easy because basically the amount of time it takes to cut the orange is almost the exact same amount of time that it takes to completely disintegrate the card. Let's go. Yeah, that'd be my fear is disintegrating the card. Find an orange. Let's go find a Well, nothing in the orange. rule says you can't the slurp out the orange juice from the orange with, yes. your, with your slurping mouth. This one's mouth. pretty soft. This one is, this is a winner. Messy. Sorry, excuse me. Are you Adam? Oh, yeah. Hey, man. Big fan. Hey, Big great fan. to meet I've you, dude. Seen all six seasons. What's your name? Sid. Sid, good to meet you, dude. All right, Sid, I 
you can hang with me if you want, but while we hang, I have to cut an orange in half okay. using only this card. But if you want to sit down with me while we do it, okay, yeah, I, I can sit down. You can totally chill. I think I need to start by focusing on getting all the skin, and then I'll focus on the okay. flesh. Okay. Oh, that's smart. Yeah, if I can get, okay, so we're already in. So this oh, yeah. feels good. Oh, but see, I just bent it. So we got to be. I would use be the corner. Careful. I would try to use the flattest part. Yeah. yeah. So I'm gonna take. I'm gonna just go. I'm gonna do one side at a time. And I cannot help you in any way. No, 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 certainly not. But you can help me by by chilling here. Yeah. You're you're being too rough with it, Adam. Ay, ay, ay. Oh goodness. Sid, would you mind checking to make sure that I'm in that we're in frame? Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, fantastic. Okay, okay, this was good. This was good. Look, look, look. Yeah. I've almost got all of the, the skin. Yeah, yeah, almost all the skin. Okay. I'm gonna try to make sure the camera can see what I'm yeah. doing. Okay, that feels huge. So we've got, we've cut all the skin. Exactly. So now I think we just have to get through the middle. Yeah. And I think you will... Go to the other side. Oh, Go to the other oh. side. This is feeling good. Yeah. Flip it around. This is feeling oh, good. This is feeling... Oh, I I got close, but I did, yeah. <laughs> did not quite get there. Okay. Here we go. Flip it on his back. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. What are you doing? Oh, okay. Okay. Look, so here's the state of the game. The card is falling apart. We are so close on the orange. Oh, you're done. That's okay. GG. I think, I think a, a fold. What Do you think? Yeah, 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 I think a fold. He's kind of really... door the exploring this to Sid right now. Sid doesn't need to do this in his life, but he's explaining it to like Sid, like, should we go under the orange? More about through the orange? Just push it. Yeah. Oh God. It just makes, yeah. Almost, oh, we're so close. Almost. Okay, it's literally just this. Okay, I think maybe with this. Yes. Ha-ha! You did it. There we go. Nice. All right. Nice. That is huge news. It's so great. Dude, I, I, I was just going to win in three episodes. Great to meet you, said. Yeah, we do. See yeah, Bye. Ooh. What do you think Adam's up to? You know what I bet he's not up to? Being chill. I'm eating a delightful vending machine pizza in the sun. Can I eat some of this orange? You should. Okay, so this is great. So I'm only like 670 coins short. So I think at this point, it is probably not worth it to double up. I think I hard because agree. Because I sort of risk getting uh, We're risk averse. We're not to get f***ed, if that makes sense. All right, shuffle, shuffle. Fight them on the beaches. Send a menacing image to the chasers from three of the following locations. A beach, anywhere where natural water meets land. A landing ground, any spot where an aircraft lands. A field, a street, a hill. What a hard fucking challenge. Landing ground, any spot where an aircraft lands. A field, a street, a hill. I guess it's only three of the following. So you could just do a field, a street, and a hill. That's pretty easy. Okay. Okay, sure, 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 sure. Oh, wait. <laughs> this puts me 70 coins short of what I need. That's annoying. It's fine. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Okay. This is a reference to a Winston Churchill speech, if you didn't, if you didn't get that. Uh, but anyway, all right. I got it, I got it, I got it. Right, I'm gonna make them tell a story. We're gonna fight him on the beaches. I suggest checking your SMS text messages. Oh. Okay. Oh, oh he's, uh-oh. He oh. looks, he looks very menacing. Oh my God. I feel very menaced. He looks like he's about to punch us. Do you think he Adam's ever menacing. punched anyone? Oh yeah, oh yeah. Let's go to the beach. No shot Adam has punched someone, right? Beach, let's go get away. They say, what they gonna say? Have, Have a drink? drink? Clink found about like bad bitches like me. It's hard to come by. <laughs> he said it like the Riddler. <laughs> say, what they gonna say? Have a drink? Clink found about like bad bitches like me. It's hard to come by. <laughs> you see, Batman, bad bitches like me is hard to come by. <laughs> Ninky Minjaj. So the card defines beach very loosely. <laughs> Anywhere where natural water meets land. Now a field. This is beautiful. Cool, I'm gonna go under this cool bridge. Whee! Whee! 
This is for sure a field. It is a field. It's not a great field, but it's a field. Six hundred more coins, baby. This is going really well. Here we go. I feel like I'm due for a hard one. The Riddler! Answer a riddle under a bridge. Tristan has recorded a riddle for you to answer. You are permitted one guess. If you are wrong, this card is vetoed. You must answer the riddle beneath a bridge. Once beneath the bridge, you cannot leave until you have attempted an answer. Oh Bad bitches like me is well, to come. I know how to get under a bridge. All right, Tristan. Let's see what you've got. Audio still booted? Adam is um is by a river. I wonder if he's doing a riddle. What a call. Under a bridge? Jesus mm -hmm. Christ. I sure hope so. I feel bad that Tristan keeps recording these riddles for us. They got insane, like, technology to follow. Hi. Hi. All right, time for a riddle. Okay. I tried to get under a bridge in solidarity, but couldn't quite make it. Close. Um, but here we go. I fly without wings. I cry without eyes. And everywhere I go, darkness follows. Think about that for a second. Okay. I cry without eyes and everywhere. Okay. I'll hold up. I'm going to close out a chat. I want to, I don't want to leak this. I fly without wings. I cry without eyes and everywhere I go. Darkness follows. I fly, fly. Maybe. Stop. Eye babies have eyes. Okay. Surprise. Wolves. Wolves. Wolves also have eyes. What flies without wings? What flies without wings? A kite? A cloud? A cloud flies without wings? And it cries because it rains. And everywhere we go, oh, it's a cloud! It flies without wings. It cries without eyes, rain. And everywhere I go, darkness follows because shadow. Like your eyelids, maybe? Your eyelashes? No, your eyelashes don't cry. Night, everywhere, nighttime. I don't think he's going to get a it. Cloud. Oh! Oh my god! Oh my god. Wait, we're the same, bro. A cloud, a cloud, a cloud, right? A cloud, a cloud. I didn't check chat, I swear to God. I swear on my father. I didn't look. I just got it. It's also not incredibly hard, because what flies without wings? It's not too hard. Rains, right? Cloud flies up in the air to wings. Darkness follows because it blocks the sun. That's gotta be cloud. Cloud. We say cloud. Say cloud. Say cloud. Say cloud. Say cloud. I hope you're having cloud. a good jet lag, by the way. Oh, Thank fisherman. You. Um, okay, I'm gonna read the answer now. The answer is clouds. Let's go. <laughs> yes. Yup. Yup. Oh, that's such a Yup. That's slightly concerning. That's like a big ass fucking plane. There's a jet. That's it's like a military jet. I hope this is our last stop here. Yeah. I can only take so much vending machine pizza. Well, you don't have to get a vending machine pizza. Yes, every yes, time. you do, Ben. Man, Adam wins, right? He made four bands. Ben and I are finally headed for Strasbourg, where Adam has been doing challenges. With the riddle complete, Adam has earned enough to get him all the way to Munster. He'll take a train to Offenburg, transfer onto a train to Karlsruhe, and then finally onto one long regional train to Munster. That first train to Offenburg leaves in 35 minutes. 
right before we arrived in Strasbourg. But if he can earn another 980 coins before he leaves, he'll have enough to get him all the way to his finish line without ever needing to stop for a challenge again. So... Wait, what? My train is in 35 minutes. I'm gonna pull one more card. Ah, uh, because I still have time to veto. Make it's just enough money. Make a ball into a cup from a distance of 10 feet. Cut. Roll a ball into a cup from a distance of 10 feet. The cup may be no larger than six inches in diameter. That's pretty wide, six inches in diameter. You may spend as long as you wish setting up items to aid its roll. You get one attempt. If you fail, the challenge is automatically vetoed. This one is very funny to get in this sort of sense. All right, I have five minutes to do this attempt. Yeah, if he had, well, actually, I wouldn't, I would, if he took the 35 minutes, he might get it. Hold up, I got beeping. That's a really hard cup. Yeah, it's the best we're gonna do. All right, smooth surface. Weir's gonna have a really smooth surface. This is like cobblestone, which I don't, don't like that. Okay, these floors are smoother. I would need space. The idea of this card is that we figured you would most likely spend quite a while setting up your shot because you only get one chance at it. I think if I'm Adam, I take the YOLO to win the whole thing. I don't spend five minutes trying to do it so I can beat it before the veto period. I spend 35 minutes doing it. And if I make it, I win the fucking game. And if I lose, then I'm out, you know? Got it. Uh, I'm in a position where I just don't have time to do that. So I think we're just going to have to kind of go for it here. You only get one shot, but you can assist your shot in however many ways you want. So you can put up barriers to easily get it. Don't feel good about this. How much time do we have? One minute. Okay. okay. So this is. Ten. He's not gonna get it. He's not gonna get it. Here we go. It's not gonna be close. One. One. We're gonna try going in. We're gonna try going in. He's not yeah. gonna get it. We are officially going to Germany. All right, I believe we have just passed New Germany. Yes. Who has replaced Adam? What AI robot is this that is just taking down feats of physicality with no problem? This is this is Kelly. Welcome to Cal. Welcome to the great uh, country of Germany. A country that is good and other times has been bad before, but seems mostly good now. <laughs> yeah, that is true. Sam, welcome to beautiful Strasbourg. Welcome back. Welcome back. We've been here before. Yeah. Um, 
in a similar uh, situation. They look guns. John nice. Darmory. He's definitely filmed with people with guns. We are not going to be here for long. We are going to go right to Frankfurt to try Frankfurt. and cut out of the We need. We're catching up. Reservations on that train, and the website is us. So we have to go talk to a real person, which yes, neither of us like to do. Oh, real people. So. Okay. Am I the only person who likes going to a store? instantly finding somebody who works there and asking where the thing that I want is. I love that. I don't like walking around aimlessly trying to find the thing. I beeline, be like, close my eyes, go to a worker. I'm like, hey, I need like dog food. And they'll be like, oh, it's there. I'm like, cool, thanks. I'm not like going around like, where's the dog food at? I do. I walk into that store and a timer starts in my head and it's like, how, what is the fastest I can get out of this place? <laughs> That's my goal. What is the fastest I can get out of here? Uh, Frankfurt. Wait. Uh, for the reservation of the siege? Okay. Wow, Adam's French. Mm. Now it filled up in the one minute. That's brutal. Okay. Team um, Bam has been oh. vinced one once again. Well, we tried to go book a reservation on the on the next train to Frankfurt, and it was full. I mean, there's a train an hour later, but I would like to not lose a whole another hour. Just get on the train. What are they gonna do? All right, pulling into Offenburg. I'll have like three minutes to make my connection. That shouldn't be a problem at all. They check tickets. Twitch ban is so reliable. Excuse me, mais j'ai oublié mon billet. Leaves in three minutes. Works every time. I legit might miss it. Run, baby, if run I with the backpack. Train, it will throw my whole plan off. Run with the backpack. What, I don't know what these signs mean. I just need to find a departure board. Oh, come on. Excuse moi. Come on, come on. Platform three. Oh, thank God. Okay, Google New. Oh. Okay. I. I think it turned out it was actually just on the platform uh, immediately opposite me <laughs> to start with. But that's fine. Easy. I am going to make it on the train. All right. A little drama never hurt nobody. Lots of luck in your senior year, boys. What the hell does that mean? Well, we've uh, looked at our options, and yeah, I think the consensus is because that train was full, we lost an hour. The best train is the one at 2.51. Well, the best train is the one in five, six minutes, but... The best train, the best train, that's, train that's not, that full. not full. Yes. Uh, you know what? I'm flipping the script. We're totally fine, Ben. We're going to crush it. We are going to crush it. In fact, we it. are crushing we it. We are currently crushing it while sitting here. And everything Team is Wadham. fine. And you know what? He has a whole. He's a. He's Team Wadham does it again, baby. Going. Yep. Light work. All right. Welcome to Carl's Room. And folks, we are on the same train for about four and a half hours. That sounds boring as shit. It's a very good move for me. It's a very good move for me. So. You know, sucks for you. Man, he's gonna be so deep in Germany's bussy. You know what we need? Unsafe amounts of caffeine. So Ben has never in his life had a Red Bull. So welcome to the snack zone. This is a solicitation for sponsorship. Cheers. 
I'm a sugar-free Red Bull guy. I like the taste of sugar-freeze more than the regular Red Bulls. I think regular Red Bulls, not the best taste in Red Bull. I wouldn't even put it top five. Pressed. Why does it taste like this? There goes a the sponsorship. I love my SFs. I get an SF ready, I'm feeling good for the day. I actually got a fridge full of them. Adam, I hope you get hit by a train. Okay. Stupid Americans always hitting their cheek to make bo bottled water sound. It's a very different shape. Hold it back. Hold it. I man, like Taste of Red Bull. He's in Mannheim. It looks like he... Yeah, Maybe that's because like of the amount of vodka Red Bulls Mannheim. I've had in my day. Well, we'll have to stop eventually. Yes, probably. I must see... Yeah, probably. I also think Coconut Red Bull's fire. All right, so this is Mannheim. What can we learn about Mannheim? Hi. Hello. Mannheim's the second largest city in the German state of Baden Wurttemberg after the state its capital, which is Stuttgart. It is Germany's 21st largest city. It's not high up. All of that is pretty boring. That is boring. Yeah, that was boring. If you don't okay, drink balls, what are you doing? Transfer. <laughs> Welcome to Germany, Sam. I wouldn't drink an energy drink called balls, man. I have news. What's the dealio, Sam? Adam has passed Frankfurt. He's passed Frankfurt? But, but he's, he's not, not on, on the high-speed high speed line. line. Good news. Interesting. He seems to be on a regional line. Well, that means he's going to lose some valuable time. Adam's route does look delightful. He's, he's riding by the Rhine. Ooh. Well, you know, at least he gets a little treat before we destroy him. What a beautiful view. Oh Dude, gosh. look at that mountaintop castle. Holy shit, in front of a riverfront? Oh my god. And look at this hiking trail? Wow. There's a castle up there. Where? I'm gonna text Ben and Sam. It's so sad that they aren't seeing this incredible view. Adam is texting us pictures of the Rhine to make us jealous. He's taunting us. So Sam is trying to come up with genius psychological warfare. Uh, what have you got, Sam? We no, we were brainstorming collaboratively. Oh, what if we call it a BT? That's a good idea. No, that's not bad. Oh, send me a picture. If it was Slime, he would send back a picture of his ball sack, but I think they're they're a little more mature than Slime and I. You're getting baited, bro. That's not where they're supposed to be. They're supposed to be further away. They are supposed to be further away from that. Is he going to fall for the bait and use the tracker and then not get enough coins to get out? Sam, what's what's the uh, what's the sitch? Okay, VO Sam here to explain the sitch. Right now, we're all headed to Moonster. Adam's train is scheduled to get in at around 7 p.m., an hour before our first rest period. Every night at 8 p.m., the game pauses for 10 hours so that we can sleep, and then at 6 a.m. the next morning, everyone returns to exactly where they were. Adam's plan is to make a quick transfer onto a train towards Emden tonight, where the ferry to Borkum departs. He won't be able to get all the way to Emden before the rest period, but he should be able to make it to a town called Lingen. Most importantly, he really needs to make it onto a train out of Munster tonight because we're gaining ground on him. Our train is faster, and it's scheduled to get into Munster only an hour after him. But to make matters worse for Adam, his train is about a half hour behind schedule, meaning he's about to miss his connection. But because all the announcements have been in German, he hasn't realized that until just now. 
All right, my train is getting in seemingly very late. Wait, okay, if the rest period's at 8 o'clock, all you have to do is hide out until the rest period. And well, then you have to get on a trade and hide out. Oh, that's tough. Ooh, this is tough. Why is Wendover Productions on this? Because it's a game show with the main VO for Wendover Productions, Sam, and the editors for Wendover Productions, Adam and Ben. I don't know how late, but it was supposed to be in Munster a minute ago, and it's still going very fast, as you can see. Um, my GPS isn't really working very well, so I can't actually tell how far from Munster Ask we are. Ask someone, Sprechen Sie Deutsch? But I'm getting pretty scared that it's far. Um, so if it doesn't arrive within the next six nah, minutes- I don't think we are empty ticket. Thank you, Logan, are, for the membership. We are not getting to Lingden, and I'm pretty sure Ben and Sam are gonna be at my station in under an hour. So, I might need to look into backup plans. Mm -hmm. I always get so much comment section critique for confidence of this game, but it's manifesting. Manifesting works. It and is. You've got to visualize your success. It's real. That's real science. You've got to believe in yourself. True. Yep. Even if it, even if all of the odds are against the trash can, I know not a trash can. One hundred percent certainty that I will win this season. What? My location is updated now. I'm not even close. What? The f what? what? This is a beautiful train seat, by the way. Uh, did he get like a business class cabin? Like, what I'm is this? I'm not gonna make it onto my train. I'm gonna arrive to my station. Ben and Sam are gonna be there within like 30 minutes. Take a bus. I, I don't, I don't, I don't understand what happened. <laughs> German kid with the chain. Are gonna be there within like 30 minutes. I, I don't, I don't, I don't understand what happened. My train was never delayed at any point. I don't understand how it's going to get in like 20, 30 minutes late. Yeah. He's on the ghost train, Ben. We don't know what he's on, but what we do know is that we got two beers. So we definitely need to be beer. That's what I said Bira. to the woman. Like, you're not going to cheers? That's kind of rude. Thank you. Drunk Ben. I'm excited to spend a lovely that night. That beer looks Munster. so good. I, I am. Munster, I'm going to eat so much cheese. I hope it's actually the place that the cheese comes from. It is not? Oh, we're here. Did you make a game plan? Okay. Okay, so my train got in uh, almost a full 30 minutes late. Uh, which is infuriating because it wasn't delayed in any way and there was no warning that that would happen. So that means I am for sure not going to make the train that I thought I was going to get on. Uh, but it's kind of Just get on any train. Because I found a backup. Love that. That goes in the right direction at least. We love this. I'll have to get off a stop earlier. Oh my gosh, I thought that woman was Sam. So Adam is in Munster. It would be ideal if he stopped in Munster because then there's a chance we could catch hey, him. Hey, you're bald. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, uh, take it for the $2. Otherwise, I don't think we're going to get Medieval have a Munster to is catch also him. the site of the world's first proto socialist uprising. Until he gets all the way. Mm -hmm. They have a beer it holder. It looks like he's on the street, so it looks like he's gotten off. This is very confusing. I like the French ones better. This is confusing. Tell, tell me what f platform it's on. Or there's Google. no, there's no information. There's literally nothing use on here about this. Okay, okay, we're just gonna have to look at every platform. I think they're gonna be here in like 20 minutes. No, 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 no. Okay. Oh, it's not. Oh no. Okay, it's delayed by 20 minutes. That's fine. They would get here in 20 minutes. They're not gonna get to you, bro. They would. They would be here. You got in it. 20 minutes. I'm almost certain. Let's go back to the board. No. Okay. 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 What are my options? Let's just look at these. I think he's fine. I just this take goes it. to D Dortmund. That's <laughs> that. I've never that, heard. No, of that doesn't war. work. They're all delayed. None of this makes any sense. None of this makes any sense. What the is going on here what is happening what is happening they're gonna be here soon all right all of the trains 
are super confusing. None of them make any sense at all. So new plan. We're going to stay in Munster. We are going to attempt no, tomorrow that's morning brain dead. to sneak onto a train. I'm going to get into the city. Uh... I'm going to hide. And to make sure I don't get caught. You're using the thing to get rid of the GPS? You know I brought a disguise. All right, we're watching episode three. Fuck it. Fuck it, bro. Fuck it, wee ball. How long is episode three? 30 minutes. I can do that. Welcome to episode three of our game of Tag Across Europe. By the way, if you guys would like to download Nebula and get a subscription, they're actually offering $20 off an annual subscription right now. And if you do that, you get access to an exclusive podcast called Layover, where they talk about what happened in the previous episode. Like where Ben said, he talked to Sid more than was on the camera about more than just oranges, but they cut it out. You can also get access to an episode one week early. And if you have $300 in faith that Nebula will last for more than six years, you can get a lifetime subscription right now, today. Check it out. Nebula.com slash jet lag. Nebula.tv. Sorry, not com. Quick reminder, welcome to episode three of welcome. our game of Tag Across Europe. As a quick reminder, each player in the game is trying to get to a different location in Europe without getting tagged. Thanks to a series of mishaps for the chasers, Adam, the current runner, is getting dangerously close to his finish location on the island of Borkum. The good news for the chasers is that, thanks to delays, Adam is now stranded in Munster, Germany, where our train should be arriving any minute, giving us a perfect opportunity to catch him. But he's got one last plan to evade us. So I'm going to stay here, go into the city, far away from where they would arrive, and to make sure I don't get caught. You know I brought a disguise. Ever since last season, I was roasted within an absolute inch of my life, uh, continually until this day, for taking off the wig that I wore. It's taking that unbelievably stupid wig off for a second. Ah! I was so mad when he took his fucking disguise off. <laughs> I got him. Oh, that sucks so much. <laughs> so the problem was, I realized, the wig is way too hot. So instead, I've got a sun hat. Now, the sun hat covers the back of my head and the sides of my head with these flappy things, right? Okay. I throw a mask on. There's no way you're going to know that that's me. Another thing I realized about my disguise, and disguises in general, is the key to them is that they can't look like disguises. So you have to think, what would go with the hat? What would somebody actually wear with this hat? And what would also cover up my bright pink shorts? Skirt. <laughs> the backpack is reversible. Plain gray backpack. Totally different vibe. They will not be looking for it. I have no idea. It's actually a snatched fit. The only problem is the shoes are fucking bleh, emoji. Where they are. Theoretically, some, they could have gotten the here shoes? about 10 minutes ago at the earliest, I think. If all of my math and guesses are right. I'm gonna guess their train was probably delayed. Seemingly every train was delayed. Ben, what did the announcement just say? Um, the, tra the train is delayed for 45 minutes because they, what? What do they have to do? They're waiting for the replacement crew here. They're waiting for the replacement crew, which is a thing. It it's is a very important thing. That happens on planes. It's currently 7.33. So that means that we would, the rest period would start while well, this was still stopped here in the station, which means we have to get off here and end our day here in Dortmund uh, and not Munster, where Adam is. Adam's going to win! We can get on a train tomorrow morning to Munster and get there before the first train to Emden. And that definitely be delayed. And it definitely won't be it's delayed. The first train of because the, day. the Deutsche Bahn runs it's on Germans. Time. Oh, it's time to be real. Tomorrow morning, I'm going to have to find some way to sneak onto the train at 7. It'll get me to Emden. I have the coins for it. I just have to get on it. I mean, I just literally have no idea where they are. They might not even be in the city. They might not even be near the city. They also might already be here. 
I hope he wears that disguise. How would you rate our performance today? I would say our performance was fine. I think failing to buy the ticket online was a is a big L. Like you should have figured that out. I would say the Deutsche Bahn's performance was confusing. Hello. Like to glare. It's not over because there's like a 13 minute period where Ben and Sam will be in the city before Adam leaves. Declare ourselves done. We are declaring day one done for the chasers. We are stopping here. We'll be here. At see you here. 6 a.m. 6 a.m. God, I'm so out of it. Goodbye. Bye. Oh, you can hear the bell. That's nice. Yeah, so it's 8 p.m. So now it's the rest period. We'll pick this up at this exact spot tomorrow morning. Shortest like Adam season said, ever. Now it's the rest period. All players will go to a hotel for the night. We will resume from the exact spots we ended tomorrow morning at 6 a.m. That 6 a.m. start is pretty unfortunate for Adam. There's not a train to Emden until 7.07, .07, meaning he's stuck in Moonster until then. But there is a train that Ben and I can take to Moonster that gets in at 6.54, meaning that if all goes well, we'll have the chance to catch him. All right, good morning. Welcome back to Moonster, Germany, uh, where we are very scared and worried important thing wait why not just I do a challenge and then use a power up to hide your gps for 30 minutes need to get on a train at 7 a.m in an hour from now and if there's someone help make dog play cs2 to, to get onto that train they might not be anywhere near here they might be uh very far away that would be very funny if i'm in disguise and they're very far away cut to them being very far away hello it is 6 a.m. Everything is totally fine. And everything continues to be totally fine. Yeah, absolutely great. So now we are going to hop on a train to Munster. Which is going to be on time. Is that what that means? It's delayed? First train of the day delayed. They can't possibly mean that. Well, it's not on there. Zug fault off. I know what that means. Yeah. Why? He's going to be able to make it to Emden. And we're... We're not. We're going to be able to make it to Emden eventually. I'm so exposed. <laughs> okay. Thanks, Adam. If they're here, there's no way that they don't get me. I'm just like, there's no one around. Literally, like every shape I see, I think is them. <laughs> like, I also, it doesn't help that I don't have my glasses on. So I'll just see like a blurry set of colors and think it's like Sam's hat. There is an 8.05 a.m. to end in. Okay. So we get on this delayed train to Munster. We missed the first train to Emden. Adam is on that train, probably. We get on the next train to Emden. And hopefully, hopefully, he's still stuck there because the ferry doesn't leave, I think, until 12.30. Adam probably thinks we have, like, accidentally gone to Amsterdam or something. Awesome. Like, like, it's got to seem so strange. I would at least be paranoid if I were him. He's paranoid as shit. I'm gonna go home board this train. I figure um, I'll sit in a side seat and look out the window so that if they were to board, they wouldn't be able to see my face. Power ups, find out where the chasers are. Yeah, why didn't he had an hour? Why not do a challenge, get a thousand coins, find out where the chasers are, and then not freak out? Okay, this is our train to. You want that one or that one? Let's go to that one. Okay. That one looks better. Oh, oh, here we go. Yes. All right. I mean, I guess even if they were on the train and it departed, it would still be great for you because you'd be so deep in your zone. I, I guess mean, they could get off on a stop. They are somehow at a station above me. Making it to Hampton. Whoa. 
Let's go, Adam. Adam has sent us a um a, a, a yeehaw emoji, a cowboy emoji. Which one's that? I don't know what yeehaw means. I don't know what Ow! yeehaw means. I think it means that he got on that train. Oh, I, I guess he was probably expecting us to get think, him before he Do you think he, he thinks he's, he's like constantly swerving us or something? Well, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Adam, I'm sure whatever you're doing is really smart and cool, but uh, you you can chill out a little yeah. bit. Oh, the tiny little, I love those. The, the gummies that it's look like breakfast. burger. Yes, man. I don't know why they taste better when they look like real food. Okay, so I'm about to get to Emden, uh, which is very exciting. Uh, there's a ferry from Emden to Borkham. If I can get to Borkham to the lighthouse, I mean, I win automatically. Uh, and the problem is I'm getting into Emden at 9.09. .09. Uh, there's a ferry at 9, so I'll miss that. And the next one is not until 12.30. I have to imagine that they will make it to Emden at that time. Uh, I mean, it's very, very possible that they're already on their way here now. You gotta farm challenges. You gotta hide your location. IMO farm challenges. Hide your location the 15 minutes before the ferry leaves. Get on the ferry with your disguise. Hopefully they don't find you. Bing, bang, boom. The train to Emden is here. Or genius W strat. Turn off your location, let them get on the ferry. You don't get on. <laughs> you just start swimming. I don't know. I don't know what his plan is. I don't know what he's gonna do when he gets to Emden. Well, that's the thing. Like, he has to know at this point that like once he gets there, he's gonna have three and a half hours until the ferry. So he's gotta have more of a plan than just let's sit around. I think the move is gonna be get to Emden, Stay in disguise, yep. do challenges, right. see if I can save up for a power up yep. to slip past them at the last minute. Smart, maybe. Smart. You know. We'll have to see. 10 minutes is such a short window. Wait, 902? There is no way that could be real. You crazy for this one, Germany. Pissoir. All right, so I'm not going to double up because that costs 250 coins. Uh, and right now I do have enough coins to take the ferry, so I don't want to risk losing those. Like, you know, first do no the harm, basically. And the Cursed. You are now a knight. You may only walk or run in the pattern of a knight. For every three steps forward you take, you must take one step to the side. You will remain a knight until you go to a castle. All right, well. That's not too bad if there's a castle close. If there's not a castle close, that's bad. Is there a castle here? Okay, no. So there are not any castles. Yeah, I think I have to veto this. I think if, if my whole goal is to avoid detection, I can't be walking in a weird pattern. <sighs> Hold up. There's no castles in Emden. M Emden, Germany. You're telling me there's not one castle in that. No, there's not one castle. Not great. Not great. Okay. All right, let's uh, let's just kind of wander into the middle of nowhere, shall we? Let's get far away from where they will go. 14 kilometers. Do you have a message for Adam, Sam? Hydrate or dehydrate. Maybe I'll get like a coffee or something. That would be nice. You know, make a day out of it. Make yeah. a morning of it. Come on. All right, Seize the your day. up. Draw another card. Please be good this time. 
Find an American flag. Find a real American flag or a depiction of an American flag in the wild. That's doable. The flag cannot be created by you in any way. There's probably not an embassy. Okay. But I bet Ooh. there's some. All right, I don't think I want to veto this again. I, I need to start earning coins if I want to be able to buy that power up. Okay. Maybe a postcard? Let's think. Let's think. Let's think. A post office? All right, so my first thought on this. Even like a public transportation place, they might have like an American flag for English. Is a, is a grocery store. Nah. I feel like a grocery nah, store would be likely to have no, I don't love it. American oh, made Yeah, that's products. actually a good point. Yeah, they would. And then those might have an American Money flag changer would be great. Them. A bank? I don't a know. bookstore? All back towards the train station. Oh, crap. Okay. Because they could be getting into that train station within 20 minutes. Okay. We're going to run to the grocery store. We're going to look for flags on the way. And I should be able to get to the grocery store and out. Maybe McDonald's. Before they could get here. Life360 thinks that Adam is uh, is driving. Do you think he's driving or do you think he's just... Oh, he could be on the bus. ...looking at... Going like a school? Proxy. Let's be on the bus. Come on. Pick up the pace. He's All moving right, at a, a bus pace. Of a downtown here. Area. You got an Italian flag here in this wine shop, maybe. Maybe like on. Could be like a Cabernet Sauvignon. Ads. Domino's Pizza. Come on. Come on, give it to me, Domino's. Yeah, nothing. All right, we gotta hurry. They're gonna be here in nine minutes. The back of a cab. We are not letting him get out of there. Unless we accidentally do. Unless we Well, you're gonna have to, Saul. We won't. I wish everything was not closed. Oh, that's the issue. Is he's there too early. Everything's closed. I bet someone in there has it. No, there's a bank. Nope. Okay. All right, we might have to veto this. I, no, don't veto. But we're three minutes from the grocery store. Don't veto. Store. Just they get might it not done. Even be coming here yet. They might not. Be anywhere nearby. Push, baby. Push. Do you think I should toss this 12 volt battery in the ocean? No, I would bring it to your local dump to the battery recycling spot. You can also recycle all batteries for free, I believe, at Costco. Okay. It's only about to talk to where he goes. Then maybe we can just get him there. Oh, come on. It's like a novelty shop. It's got so much American stuff. Simpsons. Come on. Oh, that's so close. It is really close, that fanny pack. Wow. That looks like an American, like, themed thing. Oh, shit. Yes. Yes, there. Boom. That is an American flag. <gasps> it is! All right, challenge complete. Oh, my God. I did so much running. All right, we need to disguise up now. Pull another challenge. See what we get. All right. New card. Be a good one. Come on. Two cursed cards? Cursed, you now have wet hat syndrome. For the rest of your run, your hat must be wet at all times. In order to ensure your hat remains sopping wet, you must completely drench your hat in water every <laughs> half hour. If at the Wait, half that's hour not that mark, bad. you are unable to soak your hat, that's you not may that not bad. advance he's gonna the stand game out. until you have done but so. But he's already wearing a hat. Okay, well, this is gonna be funny with this hat, but that gets me really, really close to the coins I need. Basically any other challenge and I could afford the power up. Let's buy water. Everyone has a hat for people asking. They always have hats. All right, you ready to destroy I don't know why the they always have hats. Yes, we are here in do. Emden. 
uh, where Adam... The disguise is because they have a tracker on Adam, so they can find him at any point. But if he's disguised in a large crowd, then it'd be harder. Still is. And he is... What did you say? Only like... Watching your stream to procrastinate med school, medical school studying. You're going to med school and you watch me? Bro, you're not procrastinating studying. You're getting dumber by the minute. <laughs> Good luck with med school, though. That sounds hype. Like an eight-minute walk from Hard eight, shit. ten minute walk, yeah. In the station. So the key is we've got to sneak up on him. Are they allowed yeah, to cut the person we'll off? Yeah, we can't. Let's get into a foot race. What do you mean? Right there. Nice. Uh, hello. Three water. Three water. Wasser. Danke. Guten Tag. Guten Tag. Okay. Lunch is on a MJ. Yeah. He can't go to the end yeah. point because it requires a ferry, which only leaves at 1230, and I believe it's like 1030 right now. It's moving again. Maybe we want to get in a taxi? Well, it's so close that I kind of doubt it's worth it. See, He's see. like in a big park or something. All right, I'm going to run for just a little bit to try to just build up some distance on them if they have just gotten here. And I'll probably just transition into like walking as far away as I can get. He is on this road, but he's quite far, but we need to not get spot. Spotted. Let's actually cross the road because that'll restrict our sight line. Okay. Okay. Okay, he's going further that way now. Okay. But on the same road? Yes. I'll look forward he to it, Kyle. He's just in this park. When we got to the station, he was in this park. Why okay. not fly ahead and catch him that way? I mean, oftentimes in Europe, a flight is not faster than a train. So we're not far It's not so all. big of a country that a flight is optimal. In Germany. Look, it's the water. That's cool. Okay. Well, he's by water. He's already done the How same. many viewers are in school that watch you? I think most. Yeah, he's like 60 by some I would say. canal or inlet or something. We are hot 65%. on his tail. Okay. So the key is then we have to spot him before he spots us. And we've got to be really smart about when to go in for the tag. Okay, so that's the waterway. You said he's on the other side. Here, you see? Here, Ben, look. We're right there. Well, I think what we should do, one of us post up there, the other one move in from here. From where we are right, right now. On this road. Okay. He cornered himself? Not paying attention. All right, I think I'm far enough away from the train station that I have time to pull a quick challenge. Shuffle. Greedy! Shuffle. Oh, dude, that is actually crazy. Wow. That sucks. He can't do it. The ferry leaves at 1230. It's even number. Cursed. For the rest of your run, you may only take transportation that leaves at odd numbered times. This is based on the last digit of scheduled departure times. Nope. Nope. Definitely can't do that. That's a veto. <laughs> So you understand where you're going? Yeah, so I'm going down this road. Down this road to this crossroad there. Thanks, yep. Divith. Okay. I'll okay. hide behind this corner. Yeah, yeah. Text me once you've arrived. Okay. Let's see if the disguise works. I Good hope luck. it fucking works so bad in my heart. Well. Put the phone down! <sighs> Shoot. Well, if they're not here Put yet, the phone down! I have to guess that they'll be here soon. I think we gotta just keep moving. I think we gotta just keep in motion here. Okay. So I'm here. Sam's here. Adam's there. It looks like he's always with the phone. Never. Uh, he's probably about to cross. Right up there. Never, to, never normal. and then I will follow behind.
Oh my god. He's in disguise. Yes. Hello? Ben? Yeah, he's close. He's coming to you and he's in disguise. Okay. Yeah, oh, he's in disguise. I saw him. He's in like a like a sundress or something. Sundress. Okay, got it. Got it, got it, got it. Bro, why you gotta have the phone out? I mean, you're in a disguise and you're like this. Like, this is crazy to me. God, they're running. They're running. There's no escape. I believe in you, Ben. It's actually so epic up until Sam's point of view. Like, this is so epic. Oh my god. And then Sam's point of view is like. They're running. They're running. There's no escape. <laughs> I believe in you, Ben. I just don't think. Oh. 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 I don't think there is a way out of that no, for me. I, I certainly don't think you were getting on the ferry after that. Wait, there was a way out of that. Oh, I guess he was in veto period. I don't think you can use a power up in veto period. But he could have, if he was running and he didn't have a veto, I think activated his 10 minute pause timer. And then... What the play should have been is run for 30 minutes, then use the veto card at the end of 30 minutes. I mean, uh, the fact that you have to actually tag someone makes me think if somebody just had insane stamina, they could outrun. <laughs> but I think that's probably against the faith of the show. Like, you could do that, but it'd be, like, a little bit lame, you know? Damn, good effort by Adam, a great performance, a lot of luck, unfortunately a big win for Sam and Ben, and let's see what Sam can do here. It's 2v1, but Sam's injured, so you can't really call it a 2v1, because Sam can't outrun anyone. One hell of a run. Well done. We got him. Let's go. Where the hell were you guys? Ben, what's your prediction on the first thing Adam will say when we catch up? Uh, where, where were you guys? <laughs> where the hell were you guys this morning? I thought you were going to be in oh my God. Munster. I didn't watch that like a no. Yeah, they're bad trains. Oh, they have f us so many times. I can't even begin to describe. Is there Sam? The Deutsche Bahn. Yeah, Sam. Hi, Sam. Hello. How's it going? Nice little breezy outfit you got. Did it throw you off at all? What? No. Yes, I saw no. it immediately and was like, oh, he's in a disguise. Yeah, that is true. That he did do about that. that. He did do that. Anyway, it didn't I mean, work. good luck getting out of my territory, boys. Anyways, in, in, wise, in the wise words of Adam Chase, cards, cards, give me your cards, give me your cards. In fairness, give me your cards, cards, cards. I really need them. Give me the cards. Give me the cards. Okay, okay. Here. I'm not pressed. They didn't invite me to jet lag Japan. If I was a part of jet lag, give me jet lag Bolivia. Thank you. It's 10:31. I'm leaving. Goodbye. Bye, Sam. Good luck, Sam. Thank you. Get me, get me jet lag the islands, and we have to go amongst the different islands of Southeast Asia by boat only. <laughs> ben. Okay, that was pretty perfect timing. I have just enough time to make that. Jet lag Ohio, it's Columbus, it's Cleveland. Uh-oh, it's Cincinnati. The next train south to Munster, back at the station. Storage fun. please don't let me down. Yeah, we just gotta get Sam. I think he has to, I, I think he basically has to go all the way back to Munster because these are all like tiny regional yeah, stations. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I mean, well actually, if you were trying to go directly to Paris, yeah, it wouldn't have you going back to Munster. Because like this route gets him into the Netherlands pretty quickly. Yeah, here we go. Yeah, this, I agree. I think this is what he'll take. 
Hamden to Salzburg and Salzburg to Hengelo, Hengelo to Zutphen, Zutphen to Breda, Breda to Antwerpen, Antwerpen to Paris. Damn, they're I so think deep that is zone. likely, right? That's... I bet you that he goes through the Netherlands just to avoid Deutsche Bahn. All right, slight change of plans. I've done some research and I think there's a better option than going all the way back to Munster because I can get off at a stop before them called Salzburgen. And from there, Dude, they're so in your head. There is a 35 minute transfer to a train over the border to the Netherlands. So we're going from Deutschland they're to so Deutschland. They're so in your head, bro. Sorry. Okay, what I can go. do after that is I can string together a bunch of regional trains, kind of not through big cities at all. Um, I don't think I will, Lucas. Is they will mathematically have to stay one hour behind on basically the exact same trains, but. I will have some decent, like 30, 20, 40 minute connections where I can hopefully earn enough budget to be able to keep going. And I think it gets better because the advantage of getting down to Belgium is from there, the fastest route for Ben to get to his destination. The fastest route is through Paris, my zone. So he's gonna be incentivized to go deeper into my zone, which will advantage me in the long term. So I think this is the best. That's kind of smart. All right. We're out of our freeze period, and Sam has gotten on the train that we expected him to get on, and there is another train that does the same thing in, what, like half like, an hour? Like 30 minutes from now. It's just an hour behind Sam. Can we buy water on the way? We can. I'm so thirsty. Should I like North Korea? I accidentally it, bought it, it. all sparkling water. Wasserbetten? Uh, I think Wasserbetten sells water bends. Oh. Oh my gosh, Ben, Ben. Yeah. We have to get in Germany, truly sour glowermuchen. Oh, they're glowworm. Ben, you can finally find. It does sell water beds. Find out what a glowworm tastes like. I really want to know what they taste like. Don't eat them. You can't eat them, Ben. You really like to eat one. Oh, we're on the train to Munster. Snack zone? But in a much more real sense, Adam. We're in the Where snack we? zone. Wait, wait. I was chewing. Oh. I'm gonna get through it. We're in the snack zone. We're in the snack zone, baby. Yeah. 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 Today, we're gonna be having some sour glow worm chin. It, it tastes like I'm eating a real animal. <laughs> Oh, such a bad review. <laughs> I would never buy that now. I don't want to eat a real animal for a snack. All right, welcome to Salzburg. Okay, so card shuffled. Let's hope it's a good one. Uh, it seems that he is stopping in Salzburgen, which means he's probably going to transfer to Hengelo. So well, that also means fine. that if he f***s himself on a challenge, if he does pull a challenge here and he f***s himself, yeah. we'll get him there. We will, yeah. So Sam, if you're pulling a challenge there, good luck, buddy, because you're going to need it. Let's hope it's a good one. No way. Cursed! Cursed! First, you are now being ratatouilleed. The next move you make will be decided by a rat. Please access the Smithsonian Zoo's Naked Mole Rat live feed and go to camera two. Whatever direction you first see a rat cross the camera, you must travel at least two miles in that direction before continuing. Dude, how many curses have there been? Shuffle the deck. That is, that's bad. He's, that's GG. Two miles is insane. Going two miles in a direction is like a four-mile round-trip thing. Four miles on foot. I mean, even if he's injured, so he's like, he's doing 15-minute mile pace. That's an hour. GG. Cursed. Oh, no. Oh, no. I've been ratatouilleed. <laughs> he's not going to. He's got to oh, beat up. No. But we're going to find out next time. 
All right, I wonder what's going to happen. Uh, if you're wondering what's going to happen, you can watch the next episode right now on by signing Nebula. up. On Nebula. Yeah. What else you can get on Nebula is the Layover Podcast. It's the Nebula exclusive companion podcast to Jetlag. We do an episode every single week correlating to each episode of the season itself, explaining a little bit more of the strategy, um, explaining what happens off camera, answering for our failures, uh, explaining some of like the behind the scenes production stuff. And we actually, we have a lot of that this episode because we talk about, um, we talk about what would have happened if Adam had just won the season at the beginning of day two, after we flew all the way to France. Um, one to, ferry right to, away, to, baby. To film a whole season of jet lag. Um, It'd be fire. It would not have been awesome, but we did have a plan. We did have a plan for if that had happened. So we explain all of that in the uh, layover episode this week. And also on Nebula, there's all kinds of great other stuff from all of your other favorite creators. Uh, there's a ton of Nebula originals. Those are exclusive projects that are only on Nebula. Things like The Prince, a giant stage play from Philosophy Tube. Things like Night of the Coconut, an entire feature-length film from Patrick H. Willems. Stuff from real science, real life lore, real engineering, all of the reels, a bunch of other things. Um, and also, you know, when you sign up for Nebula, you're helping to support independent Ow. creators because Nebula is creator founded and creator owned. And if you want to sign up for Nebula for a limited time, they're doing something a little unusual, lifetime memberships. All right, Chad, if you want to get a lifetime membership, it's $300. If you think Nebula will last as a company for six years, it's a good value deal. I think they'll last that long, but that's just my thoughts. Don't take my word for it. You can watch it episodes a week early. You get a custom podcast. I like watching the show. You guys like watching the show. So if you want to give it some love, feel free. It's on the trending page, along with the the damn Travis Kelsey Taylor Swift. No way. Uh, and what I want to watch is this. I'm reading every death row final meal request to find out which one's the greatest of all. <laughs> Dude, that's slime. <laughs> what the fuck? That's just slime. He's on death row for sleeping every French man with one punch. How the fuck did this happen? <laughs> I'm reading every death row final meal request to find out which one's the greatest of all time. <laughs> Today, we're looking at the selection of Alan Lee Davis. On the night of May 11th, 1982, Davis broke into the Weiler family home where he shot and killed the two young daughters and then proceeded to beat the pregnant mother to death with his pistol. As a result, Davis was sentenced to death by electrocution. And while complications led to significant nose bleeding, his execution was ultimately successful. For his final meal, Alan Lee Davis requested a lobster tail, fried potatoes, half a pound of fried shrimp, six ounces of fried clams, half a loaf of garlic bread, and 32 ounces of a and root beer. In my opinion, the quality of dishes chosen was great, but when it comes to variety, this bread left quite a bit to be desired. I'm placing this meal in B tier. <laughs> what a fucking weird series. <laughs> like, it's kind of interesting. Why? That's me! Okay, let's talk about my final meal, okay? Because I've thought about this a little bit. If I had to have a final meal, if I got if I got caught, I guess, I'd probably pick, I, I would instantly think like, oh, let me do like a gimmick, like a, the, the largest gummy bear in the world so I can live while I eat it. Obviously, that, that doesn't work. I think I would go, give me a lobster roll, right? Uh, a main lobster roll. Give me... For beverage, a cappuccino. No, 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 no. Okay, okay, okay. I think I think I have Are it. Are we I think just I have it. glossing over that he said if I got caught? C can we focus? Give me a lobster roll. Give me tonkatsu ramen. Give me. Give me a, a baguette with foie gras. Give me a beer. And then for dessert, an affogato. 
I think that's, I think that I would be like a happy man or, or, and I don't think this is technically like legal, but I would also take a blunt in a double double in like the most recent episode of one piece. And, and like, that's cheaper. And a beer. That's also pretty tight. Affogato is just a fire dessert. It's just a, an espresso shot over ice cream. I just like it. Tastes good. I didn't call you anything, all right? It's the dessert is called an affogato. I'm not saying anything inappropriate. <laughs> Relax. Um Chat, I believe it is time for me to end the stream. I gotta eat some food. I gotta get some food in me. And also I'm going to do a 24 hour stream in under 14 hours. So I wanna make sure that I am well rested before then. Uh so do me a favor, y'all. Um, have a great rest of your night. I will see you all here tomorrow at noon Pacific, 3 Eastern for my 24-hour stream. Should be a good time. Appreciate y'all watching today. Both of my streams, five hours, four hours in the book, something like that. Um, appreciate y'all. Have a good rest of your night. Have a good rest of your day if you're European. Uh, and I'm out. That's it. Peace out, everybody. Thanks for watching. Uh, while we're at it, however, we could give another little love raid to Toph, recently married. Oh, wait, he just ended stream and rated Hitch a ride. So never mind. Just go to bed. That's it. I failed. Just go to bed. Just get out of here, you rascals. Peace! The timing couldn't have been worse. Have a good one. Goodbye. See you later. Till tomorrow, noon Pacific. And I will be on time, unless Squeaks shows up late. Stays in bed or some shit. Peace!